and welcome to the Tough Mountain Show here live on a Wednesday. Uh, good evening, Game Messiah. How the devil are you? Hope you're well, buddy. Hope you're well. As always, the chat room is open. No religion and politics. Apart from that, we're all good. Uh, 18 days, 9 hours and 8 minutes. It's now the 30th of April. A new season to plan for. This is going to be a very nasty stream, I think. Right, so yesterday we ended it with seven games. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. So yeah, it was the Huddersfield game. We won 5 1. We actually done all right. We're never ever going to sneak into the playoffs. Um, and that's the final league table. Ninth in the end, nine points off. Never going to happen. But considering we didn't win. Oh, right. Okay, mate, cool. I will get on to that. I didn't, I thought I set it up for a year, but obviously not. <laughs> Appreciate that, buddy. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know if I can do that here. I know I can't do it on my phone. Well, I'm just bringing it up now. I thought I changed it for a year, but obviously not, mate. <laughs> right, I'm looking at... Do you, where is it on Discord, mate? I have no idea. <laughs> I'm staring at Discord. I'm like, I have no idea. Oh, and the tablet shut down. Oh, this is a good start. Right, I'll have to deal with Discord later because I haven't got a clue what I'm doing. Right, I've shut Discord. Right, and the chat room's gone down. <laughs> what a start to the show. <laughs> so, I've got the chat room up, but I'm not looking at the game. <laughs> I'll have to Google that on Discord and work that out later, or tomorrow, or tomorrow. Fair one, buddy, fair one. Come on, tablet. Bloody thing. Right, I think we're back with the tablet. Right, yeah, I'll have a look at Discord later, but appreciate letting us know, mate, because otherwise I would not have known. <laughs> Right, tablets back up, nearly. Once it stops spinning circles. <laughs> oh, I need a new tablet. I need a new code on Discord. I've not done well tonight. <laughs> oh. Right. Is that working? Not getting it's not Yes, yes, the tablet's back and working. Your bits, your, bits, your lovely, lovely bits. The tough man loves your bits. Nice one, Jack. Nice one. <laughs> 
Uh, I'm gonna. I don't know, Jack. To be fair. Um, so yeah, we finished the season uh, with seventy points, nine points off the playoffs. Financially, we're screwed. We can't offer a contract to anyone. We can't. We got no budget. So I not sure. I did want to do like a good ten years at Cardiff, unless the right job comes up. So for now, we're gonna plow on. Um, Oh, to be fair, we're only losing Doogie out of the first team. Danny's a backup left back who ended up being first choice. I want young Nathan to stay. But what I'm going to have to do if I stay is get rid of Julian on 64 grand a week. Probably Keith as well. 41 grand to sit on the bench is far too much. <laughs> I bet, mate. Is it Chelsea now? I, was, I know he was linked with United earlier. Um, <laughs> bless me. Good evening, buddy. Hope you're well. Hope you're well. How the devil are you? Uh, but yeah, I bet you will be, mate. Because I thought Tony was almost a shoe in to go to Arsenal. But yeah, right. So the club needs to be sold or we need to raise funds. Or I need a new job. <laughs> They're giving me nothing to spend. Next year's wage budget is half a million. But I've got 30. If I reckon I can raise 40 million by two cells. Chelsea are on him. Right, right. Because it first said he was off to Saudi Arabia. Then it said United. Um... Oh, yeah. It's a tournament you've done before, mate. How did you get on? It was one on one. You don't, did you win it last time? You done really well, didn't you? You won by 20 seconds. One hour and 29. Nice, mate. <laughs> Nicely done, mate. Nicely done. A little clap it in there. <laughs> the board at last. Oh, it's not my fault the club's reputation hasn't grown. It's because you lot are bloody awful. Oh, even better, mate. You beat your coach. Sweet. Well, the players don't feel like we can uh, hit the playoffs. Fair one, mate. Fair one. Have a cup of coffee to celebrate. <laughs> a team meeting. Nice, mate. Nice. <laughs> yes, so we've uh, we've got pre-season to plan. We've got pre-season to plan now. As always, I do like to put a date in the diary. Your picks. Your picks. Your lovely, lovely bits. <laughs> That's how my loves. Your bits. <laughs> oh, I just, I, if I knew Cardiff was this struggling for cash, I don't know if I would have come here. Never mind, never mind. We're here now. <laughs> I want to stay for 10 years, but if the Liverpool job comes up, Uh, I'm not talking to the press about that. So the Saints jobs come up. I think they're even in a worse position than me. <laughs> oh, I wish I could take the blame, mate. I've not spent one penny since we've got it.
every player I bought. Yeah, we've yeah, we've, do you see? Oh, there it is. Club info facilities. We got a basic youth system rather than a poor one. <laughs> <laughs> so we've we've improved behind the scenes. The youth, uh, the youth has gone the basic, and we got a good training ground. We didn't have any of that when I turned up. That's the only money I've spent at this club. Everything's been free transfers, and there's not been many of them. To be fair, oh, there's more there than I thought. <laughs> That, that was the whole plan, mate. Yeah, get some young kids out the youth team. The good thing is, the youth team last year, the under-18s, they went the whole season. Invincible! We've never seen that before. But So the youth system did win 32 out of 32 games and smashed in their league. Not the hardest league in the world when you look at the teams in it, from the Chippenhams to the Slows, the Frooms, the Gloucesters, but we'd still smash that league. And I think the 21s are in the playoff final against Bournemouth. So it's not as bad as I thought the youth system. Yeah, on oh, next season, I think I'll be playing quite... I've played quite a lot of them. My um, left back this season in the end. Ooh, wrong one. Where is he? Londa Hughes. He come through and he he done really well for us. <clears throat> um, Nath Williams. He's out of contract, but he's done all right for us. And I'll put the other ones back down. But I think the plan will be to sell Alex and get Julian off the wage bill. If I can raise 30, 40 million quid, we've got a chance of going. It's a big if, though. It's a big if. <laughs> and power as well. In the team of the week. But we can't pay him 40 grand a week to sit on the bench. There is a couple of free players I've earmarked. But there's no point going for them until I've cleared some debt. They literally are letting me offer the players 500 quid. 500 quid. I spent more down the kebab van. Do you know what I mean? Oh. Harris played a few times. He's in the under-21s. Double hernia. Well, Reese is at the end of the season. But I think everyone knows what killed me um, this season. I got through two points off the playoffs going into January, thinking just add a couple of players and we'd be all right. I had the money there ready to go. The wages ready to go. Just before the window opened, they slashed my wage bill down to half a million from 600. <laughs> And I had no money, so I couldn't bring anyone in at all. And then I lost the centre-back, my left-back, it was on loan, recalled by the parent clubs. My other centre-back went down for two months. Then the right-back went out for six months. And just to top it all off, the keeper went out for five weeks. So I lost my whole back line and literally was playing academy players through January and into the start of December. It destroyed me. We never recovered. <laughs> but yeah. Next season, it will be the youngsters coming forward, I think. It's going to be a long, long summer. That's all I know. So, yes. So, yeah, I've got a Dutchman I've earmarked to come in in midfield. I can't remember who else it was. It was three or four free transfers. I've gone, we'll have him. We got Anson for free. He's been decent for us. Not great, but decent. That was 20 grand. And that is my scholars for next season. 
<laughs> yes, mate. Yeah, it's not a lot, mate. It's not a lot in footballing terms. The young centre back who's out of contract asked for a grand, and they won't let me give him more than five hundred. It's just a nightmare. But my top talent hasn't even got a gold star, not even fully potential. <laughs> oh. And only one's Welsh. Non league standards. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bottom, 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 bottom talent. <laughs> they all played rugby this year. That was the problem in Cardiff. <laughs> nice. The under 18s keep that 100% record going. But yeah, I think the whole of Wales just went, nah, we're not playing football this year. No. But I'd like to think someone would like, Cardiff have got a 42,000 seat a stadium. We've got the Real Madrid one in two. You'd like to think someone would go, yeah, we'll buy that club. He's going to get us up. We'll give him a couple of quid. And the only promotion... Bitch. Bitch. Josh, how are we doing? You're it's Josh bitch. Bosch. Good time, you're <laughs> bitch. Cheers, buddy. Cheers, buddy. How are you doing today, mate? Hope you're well. Hope you're well. Now you've finished taking a mick out of us Liverpool fans on Discord. <laughs> Evening bitch, five. Bitch, <laughs> lovely, lovely bits. Good stuff, man. Love. I am five. You are spot on. I am dreaming of the Champions League with Cardiff. I, the Premier League right now is what I would like. <laughs> but we got another long season in the Championship first. Glad you're well, mate. Glad you're well, Josh. Just make five mod. <laughs> I'm worried what you're going to do now, fight. <laughs> <laughs> You'll love it, Josh. I'll get you a front row, row front row seat. You can even sit on the dugout next to me if you want. Uh, I don't game of is on top of the scoreboard, so he, that's his home now. He's made it. In, he's got his sleeping bag and everything there. <laughs> oh, cheers, bless me. Cheers. That first year when we missed out last year, that may come back to bite me, but. I have even been thinking about changing tactics. I should have said, are you sat down? Are you sat down? <laughs> I've not changed tactics since I left 4-4. Bloody two. <laughs> but Wayne Rooney has absolutely smashed the championship. And I'm thinking of nicking his formation. Which is one... So you've got the old in man in here, the two in here. So yeah, you're basically just swapping that round, really, doing that. So I think I might do that next season, but I think, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> oh, you can never not call me flexible, mate. <laughs> right, they're all on holiday, so that doesn't matter. <laughs> Oh, go back to, I, I used to just play 3-5-12, well, 3-4-1-2. Never, ever had a fullback. It was just three centre-backs, four midfielders, three strikers. Three players are off, going to the old French Youth Cup. The two, is that the too long tournament? Is that the one, is it they call it something, or they used to? <laughs> oh, that was a joke from earlier. Josh was winding me and fire up. I nearly put the stream on so Josh and Fire could just argue on it. Just arguments. <laughs> the Josh and Five argument show. <laughs> right, right. Yes, mate. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think you, I've, I think I've seen you use it. I swear, I'm game aside, I might be wrong though. Um, but yeah, that was what you were going to recommend, right? When we had our dreadful start last season, <laughs> I just like being attacking. That's why I play it that way. 
That is the main reason I play it that way, because I want to be attacking. And it works when you're at Real Madrid, but it's not working at Cardiff. So it might be something I put in place in pre-season. We've got 50, 41 days to worry about it. Fair, oh, bless me saying the same. Uh, you haven't heard Josh. We're just going to play Trent number six now. <laughs> just to get Josh going with a uh, fight. <laughs> but yeah, that's a, the anchor role with, is what Rooney played at Bristol City this year. And they absolutely destroyed the league. Oh, where am I going? Hundred and four points through when he got in the end. He was like thirty points clear, I swear, twenty points clear at one stage. <laughs> no worries, fine, I'll take him. Oh, ow, oh. <laughs> Monday the 19th. Right. No, he hasn't. Is it still free now? Did he, oh, right. He lost his cup game as well. <laughs> oh, did he lose his cup game? Because they're one in front, didn't they? So it's free league. They aren't one in the league in free. Ah, okay, mate, I'm with you. They won the cup game, but um, Watford beat them 2-0. Right, I'm with you, buddy. <laughs> I'd play Trent everywhere. Up top, on the wing, centre-back, even in goal. <laughs> <laughs> like metonomy, yeah, why not, mate? Why not? <laughs> oh, that's what I was doing. Oh no, wrong one. So yeah, that's him. Oh, he's a centre off. No one wants him. So that could be my free signing to replace old uh, thingy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but Tommy is Manchester United's DNA, <laughs> says Rio Ferdinand. I'm not a fan of Rio Ferdinand as a pundit. Not just because he played for United. I'm just not a fan of him. He's up there with Michael Owen. He's that good. And that's saying something. But yeah, 24 hours later, he's in Napoli. <laughs> right, eating spaghetti. Look, shy eating spaghetti. <laughs> Oh, relegated Leeds. We could take a relegated Leeds. My dad does support Leeds, so, oh, I don't think I could. I couldn't go to Leeds. Then again, I never thought I could go to Arsenal. Newcastle are champions. I've never thought, wow, well, I wouldn't have thought that.
still at Ellen Road. Oh. <laughs> yes, mate. <laughs> yeah, oh, Danny Mills ain't great either, is he? <laughs> <laughs> Fair one, Fi. <laughs> oh, the old deluded Man United fans. I was I did enjoy watching the Brighton game with a Man United fan. He was jumping about the room when that goal went in. I was like, mate, it is leg. He's offside. No, 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 it's over the line. It was over the line. I thought it said 4.3 mil. I got excited then. Oh, someone's coming for a youngster. Four, four, 4,300. We might need him next year. I know he's out of contract. Well, I'm not going to cry over five grand. <laughs> Just say hipster, same thing. Yes, <laughs> Now, I did mention Owen. I did, to be fair, Josh, I did say Ferdinand's up there with Michael Owen. So I was, I wasn't being totally biased. <laughs> but Owen's a traitor. He's a Man United player in my eyes. <laughs> Fair one, fight. He did, yes, he, yeah, he got that derby goal, didn't he? When City weren't very good. <laughs> my old uh, lodger, my first ever lodger. Uh, oh, friends on a show, Preeny eighty six. He's been on the watch alongs. He was only a little boy. He's a bit younger than me, uh, and he had Michael Owen on everything, on his shirt and all sorts. And when he left for Real Madrid, he was, he was telling me, he was only a little boy, he was crying his eyes out. Oh, five mil. That could save us a lot of hassle. Huh? 23 grand a week as well, and five million. Could be the start of the sales. Yeah, and he cried his eyes out when he went to Real Madrid. And when he went back, when he went to Man United, it was as close as he's got the crying again, because he was a bit older by then. I think he burnt his shirt or something like that as well. <laughs> yes, it should be, shouldn't it? Nico, how are you doing, buddy? Hope you're well, mate. Hope you're well. Uh, must be nearly back to school time. Hope you've had a good summer holiday, buddy. Yours was Beckham, yeah. Yeah, I know a few United fans who would say Beckham too, mate. So, the season summary. Well, there's not really much to talk about. Moving on. <laughs> horrendous start, horrendous middle. Not a bad end. That sums our season up. Carabao Cup. We beat Bath. Brentford, Bath went out to Bristol City. The FA Cup was very disappointing. We lost to Warsaw. We were virtually bottom of League One. Unbelievable. That could have helped us out with cash. No. Um, to Robbo, he got 24 goals. The stadium had 71% full. That's not bad. All right. Okay, mate. Good luck tomorrow. Good luck tomorrow, Nico. Hope you do well, buddy. You were annoyed he was at Madrid. Fair one, Josh. <laughs> Well, like moments to remember. Five win last night, the 5 1 win. 3 2, Robbo late goal. Oh, yeah, we were 2 up. They got it back to 2 all. And then we nicked it. Ah, oh, so kind, Josh. Thank you for the sub, mate. Ah, oh, uh, Tanika, it's really kind. Cheers, buddy.
he said, good luck, sub. <laughs> fair one, mate. Fair one. But yeah, I wish you all the best tomorrow, Nico, uh, with your exam. I hope you get up to go up to year five next year. Uh, did How did you do in your exams in the end? Uh, did you do well? Oh, I got manager month in September. Oh, There's not really much to worry about there. <laughs> nice one, Josh. Nice one. Too kind, buddy. Too kind. <laughs> ah, right. Fair one, Nico. I couldn't even tell you about our school system anymore. Yeah, I left school in 1997, so that was last century. So that's how long ago I was at school. <laughs> Well, I'm 43, 44 next month. <laughs> Another one to add, mate. Is that 8 out of 10? That's 22, Josh. 22. Why is that going off? Oh. Mm. Cheers, curry. There's a sale on it, curries. I didn't need to know that either. <laughs> yeah, fair one, Jack. <laughs> yeah, it was just for fun school. Yeah, yeah, and just to play football. The minute the uh, the football season ended in my fifth year, I basically stopped going. I was like, that'll do me. <laughs> Now I can tap off the tap. <laughs> tap. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Bless me. <laughs> All right. Okay, Nico. All right. I see. So if you don't get your mark of six, you've got to basically do summer school and then hopefully you caught up and you do the exam at the end of August. Fingers crossed, you go again. <laughs> oh. We're not paying tax because we're skin. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's nice of the board giving us seven and a half million. So we've got 18 million now. And we're about to sell someone for five. You've got French, right? I yeah, I done French at school. I remember about three sentences. Not good. <laughs> oh, there we go, Jack. Tottenham have won the FA Cup. Yeah, well, it's a, it's a good cheap deal, isn't it? £10 million add-ons for Chizzy. Um, yeah, you know, obviously, I, I, a winger wasn't something we were all thinking of. I know he can play up top, but he's a wide player. He plays up top. I'm sure um, you'll be able to tell me more about him, to be fair, uh, Nico. I don't know too much about him. I, his dad was a professional who played for Italy, didn't he? Um, I remember his dad a bit, but I know uh, there's a Northern Irish guy, I think he is. Uh, he does a lot, a lot of Liverpool watch-alongs. And he was saying, like, a couple of years ago, before he'd done that big injury, he was being touted like a £100 million footballer. Whether that's true or not, I don't know. So if we've got him for £10 million and he stays fit, it could be decent. I just hope he's not Moe's replacement. <laughs> Inverted forward. Right, right. Breadstick as a winger. Yeah, so I'm only going off what I saw on uh, on uh, on socials, nothing more. Um, I had to Google him. I didn't even know who he really was. 
There's no truth that Robbo's going to Bristol City. He's my only striker. But yeah, someone said he's only, he only missed like two, two, three weeks or something last year since that bad injury. But I don't know. I don't know. If he does well, good. Uh, we, we obviously got a good cheap player. Right, oh, that's exactly what they were saying on Sky Sports News, Nico. Yeah, uh, he's, he doesn't like going up top, um, but he likes to play on either wing. So, yeah, if oh, fingers crossed if he does well. Right, we've got rid of Hyde for five million. That's a step in the right direction. Thirteenth of June. Oh, I don't want to go for that player until I know I can offer him money. I know I can reduce what I've got in the. Oh, I won't be signing players for money, so. Right, that you rate him that highly. Is it better than Diaz? Well, that's, that's a good recommendation then. Um, and if he's only, you know, for 10 million we, and he stays fit, we could have a right bargain. Um, Nico is saying the new Liverpool lad, Chizzy, we got from Juventus. Uh, well, it looks like we've got him from today. Um, but yes, 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 Chizzy. Yeah, is, I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name right. <laughs> As I said, I remember his dad from Euro 96 more than him. <laughs> That's pretty bad, isn't it? <laughs> um, but yeah, I've got to build players to sell. Definitely Game Messiah. That, that yeah, I can, like, you put it exactly perfect there. Learn to let them go. Um, that is exactly right. Yeah, that's it. I remember his dad. I think he even scored at Anfield, if my memory's right, because I used to love the Italian footballs back in the 80s and 90s. Um, so, yeah, that's what I remember. So, it's Kizzy. They pronounce it Kizzy. Is that right? I hope I've got that right this time. It's Julian. I don't want to lose Julian, but I can't pay 64 grand a week as a mid-table championship side. Oh, he's played 330 games for us. He's been good for us. But that's a hell of a lot of money to be on. We're a year left for his deal. Oh, cheers, buddy. Cheers. <laughs> That's it, Jack. That's exactly what I'm thinking. I didn't realise he only had a year left on his deal. He won't sign in. There's no way we can offer him a new deal at 64 grand. But he's injured, so I don't want to put him up for sale until he's back from injury. Three weeks, so could be closer to deadline day. Oh, right, it means church. Right, mate. I would never have known that. Nice one, Nico. Nice one. Your bits. Your bits. Your lovely, lovely bits. The tough man loves your bits. <laughs> cheers, Josh. Cheers. If you recovered from the offside goal. <laughs> your 
new bags, new bags, new lovely, <laughs> lovely bags. The top man loves new bags. So I'd love to get this man back on loan. Not going to happen. Right, Charlie needs to get promoted. He had a good pre-season for us last year. And if we're selling matey boy for five mil, he's a great replacement. Well, I say replacement. Right, he was a bench warmer. Bench warmer. So... Charlie can warm the bench. Not a problem. Your lovely, lovely bits. <laughs> uh, we've also brought in the Georgian goalkeeper, but we've loaned him straight back to Vientia. So he's they're saying he's Allison replacement in a couple of years' time. So, yeah, at the moment, he is our only player. Every penny counts, haggling over it all. Well, that's all right, we needed him. <laughs> yeah, it is really just a one signing. But I'd rather us not sign players for the sake of it. Uh, it's not a bad squad there. Yes, we needed improvements, 100%. But I'd rather them not waste money and just panic by like we've, like we've seen in the past. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I think we got a decent team. Yeah. Uh, um, yeah, we'll find a way to beat Tottenham. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a long time ago, bless me. Long time ago, but we'll have another clap just for you, mate. <laughs> yeah, oh, it was great being with a United fan when it happened. Right, Doogie, we keep it. He's a decent backup, so this trigger is a, that's a simple one. Danny Smith. He was my backup left back. 18 grand a week. All right, he's out of here. I'd rather play London than that other young lad. We know about Dan. We know about Harris. He had a few minutes last season. Right. I don't know why. Right, that's the players. Now the staff, right. <laughs> Josh has already got over that disallowed goal. 
Oh, I can't wait for Sunday. I reckon there'll be no Man United fans turning up to watch it with me. <laughs> Right, so Int has just got four players, two on a three. Ah, right, okay, mate. <laughs> right. Oh, the director of football's got a lot of work to do. That's why I pay him, so I don't have to. So we're going to need another under 21s a manager. Right, I was just working that all out there. Right, I've been wanting this lad since I saw him available. 100 grand, you greedy Dutchman, but we're getting him for free. First replacement. Oh. <laughs> they said Mount was injured, were they? Oh, right. I thought he just swapped him off. Um, but yeah, I, I, over, we were well, the third best team in the country last year. Only dipped off, what, it, right at the end. So, But it's all new, isn't it, I'll with a new manager? It's all new. Right, right, right. So that could be a couple of players coming in then. Midfield and a striker. I wanted him last year, the Brazilian 21-year-old. 16 finishing. 
Right, we've bits. made some uh, better improvements. Lovely, lovely bits. The top man loves your bits. <laughs> cheers, Jack. Cheers. Too kind, mate. Too kind. Is that all he wants? Your bits. Your bits. Sweet. Your lovely, lovely bits. <laughs> top, nice one, Josh. <laughs> Right, he's going off at a new deal, aren't they? Don't worry about it. Right. 24 days to go to the first preseason. Will there be a change in formation? <laughs> uh, right. Prediction. It's a hard one because form sort of goes out the window. I know it's very cliche to say that, but United Liverpool, you know, it, it form goes out the window. When United were on top all for them years, you still felt you had a chance if Man United come to Anfield to upset Fergie and Co. So you never know. But after watching the Brighton game. And then seeing the way Liverpool played against Brentford, especially the second half, I fear for United. Uh, I can see us going there and, what, winning another 5-1 or something? <laughs> I had to say it. <laughs> but yeah, three points is all I would like. Uh, another 2-0. Another 2-0 will do. But yeah, it could go either way, couldn't it? So I know that's very cliche, but it's true in derby games. Hello, the gamer. How you doing, buddy? Hope you're well. Hope you're well. You had to go two one United. I'm not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, can we get Maguire and McTominay? Oh, nice, mate. Uh, you're off again. You're out again on Friday. Fair play, buddy. Fair play. Hope you have a good night. I'm surprised the lick was on the bench the other night. We, My mate, again, I was what my United fan, I was watching it with. He was sat there going, why is Maguire in when De Litt's on the bench? So I'm a bit surprised if, if De Litt doesn't play. Very surprised. <laughs> By Josh, if Liverpool win, they get Josh a seven up. There's an offer you don't get every day, Josh. Oh. Oh, you could have had that. I would have allowed that, Josh. I've just seen what, what Nightbot stopped. That would have been all right. Darren Purse for tyres from football. Cheerio! <laughs> we need a Josh off. I'll get Smokey on it straight away. <laughs> Yeah, see, it's not all just for you, fight. It's just not all picking on you. <laughs> all right, I'm happy we're bringing him in. Happy to bring him in. Not a Dutch international, but solid centre half stroke midfielder. Could he be my new anchor man if we go that way? Go get him. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you would love to have Nunes. Oh, it'd make United a good team. Best striker on the pitch if you had him.
right, we're not going to get him back. <laughs> yeah, fair one, fight. <laughs> Go sit in the corner. <laughs> There was links of um, was it Arsenal today, I think. 73 million to Arsenal. I was like, yeah, do it, do it. I don't think Game Messiah will be too happy with it, but I swear I read like Arsenal was sniffing around him and Liverpool won't accept anything less than 73 million and that's it. You load of bollocks. Fair one, mate, fair one. I was a bit surprised when I read it, to be fair. I'm not going to lie. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Hold it in, hold it in, hold it in. We had Cundle last year on the wing, on loan. So midfield, me right midfield. And a striker. We're putting a team together slowly. Fair one, five. Fair one. <laughs> I was. I wouldn't do normally. I just didn't want to sneeze all over the computer screen. <laughs> but yeah, no, you're right. It's not healthy to hold it in for sure, mate. For sure. <laughs> God, we've got Matip to come back yet. Yeah. yeah, it'd be a great signing. We've only had that sort of cash. Fifty-two grand a week. You're on a laugh, mate. That can't be right. Walk away. Walk away. Walk away. Walk away.
Oh, dear, oh, dear. Um, <laughs> not 100% sure, mate. I don't want to say yes, because I've said yes on the last two games. The first game of the season, we had like five, six people in, and they would have been talking in the background, and it would have just got me stressed out. So, and then last week, Smokey was supposed to come, but he got a bit drunk. He doesn't drink very often, but he had a family party, and he, him and his uh, good wife were a little bit hungover with the kids on Sunday. So, yeah, we uh, I don't want to say yeah, but uh, I was speaking to Smokey about it on Monday night. So and we're hoping to do it. So fingers crossed, Josh, fingers crossed. But yeah, I don't want to say yeah and not do it, if you know what I mean. Forty one grand. Not a chance, and no, walk away. Right, stop buying players because we can't. No, right, that's it. <laughs> You'd love to see a stream meltdown. <laughs> or oh, you hiding somewhere. Fair one, Josh. Cheers to the beer. <laughs> right, we might have been able to recruit a few. I'm trying not to loan players because they do my nutting. Well, it's more their manager phoning up going, Oh, you said you're playing on the right wing as a bloody this winger. Then you said you're playing as a vetted winger. Oh, I'm not happy. Is he playing? Yeah. Enough said. Leave me alone. Get out of my office. Nice. We're getting the players in. It's a shame because the loan market's a great way to go. But yeah, you know, oh, if you don't play them exactly how their other teams do, they all moan and it does my head in. <laughs> Will guys out of contract and what? Oh, no, it's not. No, it's not. No, he's not. No, he's not. He's out of contract at Cardiff, not at Arsenal. And, oh, Christ, my heart skipped a beat then. Yeah, well, we've. I think I've managed to snap in a few, mate. Um, so we've got the Dutchman coming for free. He's played 100 games in the top flight for uh, Alkmaar. Uh, we got Jan coming in, who's a Brazilian striker with 16 finishing. Um, we've got Matt uh, Kundal, who we had last season. Uh, he's coming in. Oh, we've got to pay 300 grand. Oh, we bought Jan, sorry. Uh, hopefully, we had Felipe and Francisco. So, if we can add those four, we've done all right. And there's still more to come. Haven't said it today. Come on, the old jack bastards, as they are known. <laughs> I 
Penny wants a couple of quid. Under 21. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. And Hyde leaves for Oxford. He was a replacement on the bank. So to get five mil for him and to get those 20 odd grand off the wage bill. Oh, that's one hell of a name, isn't it? Oh, we, like, we do like a Muhammad in the team. See, look at the finishing. First touch. Composure. Oh. Because I'm thinking of flogging Alex. I really am. Liam's going to be the name man up top next season. Jan will back him up. Alex, you're gone. He's not going to sign a new deal. I'm not going to go for him yet, but he could be a nice little cheap replacement. Your bits, your bits, your lovely, lovely bits. Oh, I was down the rabbit hole. You just made me hit the ceiling, mate. I just jumped then. <laughs> oh, oh, Josh, you just give me an heart attack. Oh, thank you for your bits and my skip of a beat of my heart. <laughs> I was too busy looking at finances. I was miles away. Oh. Nice fight, you're doing really well with St. Etienne. Fair play, mate, fair play. Yeah, apparently uh, Barasic is going on loan to Barca. Um, there's been talk of other loan deals in England. I'd rather him stay at the club. Uh, I know he didn't play last year, but the year before that, he had a really good start to the season. Uh, a really good season. So I'd like him to stay, but if he's not going to play... And he's going to go and play other clubs. He might as well go and get minutes in his leg because he is a young lad. But it's weird thinking he's going to go to Barca. Exactly, mate. I was, you took the words out my mouth. You took the words out my mouth there, buddy. Is he going to get any playing time for Barca? That's exactly what I was going to say. And the oh, the Welsh under twenties have knocked out the French nineteens in the final. <laughs> Oh, Wales have won international glory at the French Youth Event Invitational 2045 tournament. Pretty sure that's a too long tournament in in real life. Yes, a hundred percent agree with that fight. Let him go. Um, let him go to, with Pep in Salzburg, and they have gone. Uh, they've got into the Champions League, haven't they? Fair play to Pep, and he is my assistant on here. Nathan Williams got the player of the tournament. And he's a young centre-back. He had four goals in five games. Fair play.
Liam McCarthy, who's he play for? Southampton. Now we got a Scottish Blues. No worries, Josh. Enjoy your dinner, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, you have about 35 more years to go, mate. <laughs> Joint top goal scorer, Nathan. He's at Monaco. He's at Nice. We're all right. Oh, it's weird when you're not actually playing a game. <laughs> Maybe I should have went, oh, no, 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 I couldn't. I couldn't because I got beaten by Dancer playing darts again. Well, he's going. No, he's going. I'd like to sign a new keeper. Come on, Malaga. Give me 30 million. Well, yeah, we've got an academy player playing left back. That's why. Well, good meeting. I learned absolutely nothing. Yes, mate. I did see that. I did see him. Uh, the world record. Uh, uh, yeah, I did see that. <laughs> it was ridiculous about the seasons, wasn't it? It's two thousand five hundred and fifty or something. It was, wasn't it? Well, I was going to do that, but I haven't got around to it yet. we still got Stefan, Ronda, Nathan. He's off. Not worried about staff right now. Right, we might not get so many colds if we bring in a new head physio. <laughs> yeah, cheers, fire. You want me to beat him, but that means I haven't got a life. Fair one. <laughs> Right, Chris is gone. No way am I selling Jack Hughes. No way.
<laughs> I was only joking, Fi. Don't worry, don't worry. I know you didn't mean nothing by it. <laughs> and to be fair, I did actually agree with you as well. <laughs> Oh, the squad is coming together. Don't moan, mate. You promised to loan me out. Um... He's moaning because I didn't let him go to Bury, and he's not happy. Oh, lucky you signed a new contract before you started whinging. <laughs> right. Jack, I've made you. You're not going to Bristol City. Right, he's not going to a rival. Fair enough. That's what we like to see. Jack there, understanding what we're doing. Sorry, Wayne, you clearly don't know where the derby game is. Bristol and Cardiff, the seven-side derby. Think I'm selling players to you? No chance. Thank God for that. They're improving youth facilities once again. Love to get him for ten mil. <sighs> yeah, it's pointless. There we go. The youth team will be improved by November. Happy days. Uh, no worries, buddy. No worries. Yeah, we've we've actually had a decent. Um, I'm happy with what we've done so far. The board have agreed to make the um, youth system better. We've managed to free up quite. We've managed to bring in quite a few players. We've sold one for five. We've got one up for sale for thirty. So yeah, we've we've. I think we've improved. That we've definitely improved. Whether we've got. Great players or not is a different matter, but we've improved the squad. Um, oh, Flip A is the next one in. Oh. Um, yeah, mate, yeah. So I, I managed to get my... The main one I wanted was uh, Van Voort. Uh, we've got him in. That's it, mate. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, and then, it, yeah. And well, Chuck, we got Cundle back. We had him on loan last year. So we've got him now coming in for free. We've signed Jan. 
finishing 16, a young Brazilian. So we're quite, I know he doesn't look great now, but we're finishing of 16, fingers crossed, but he won't tackle, one. <laughs> yeah, mate, definitely, definitely. So the boards agreed to go up again. So we're going from hopefully poor to average. Um, so that's a step in the right direction. We've got 26 million and I've put someone up for sale for 30 million. So if Alex goes and Malaga want him, and he was awful for us, we're going to have, uh, we've got another free striker coming in. So yeah, we'll be all right with free strikers, but Alex got a year left on his deal, he won't sign a new deal. So we've got to try and get that 30 million for him. The one thing I want to do, which I haven't done, is gone for a keeper. I'd like to get a better keeper, but I've not even actually looked really. But Philippe, we've got here. I like Philippe. He looks half decent. From Bournemouth as well. Another Brazilian. Right, trigger extension. Easy, easy. Thought I went for American. Oh, there we go. I, I talk about a goalie and one comes along straight away. And we've Nick Swindon's head coach. <laughs> right. He's... Yeah, we're trying to get more defenders in, mate. Don't worry. 35 grand a week. I'm just doing it. I'm just doing it. Oh, nice, mate. Doing a Newcastle one, like Keegan. Gung-ho tactics. Oh, mate, that'd be quality. <laughs> Is it? Have you found it easy to buy players uh, for Newcastle with financial fair play? Has that affected you at all? Malaga's offered us 20 million. 20 million, potentially up to 32 and a half. Twenty mil up front into three instalments of uh, two mil, sixty six million after fifty games. We've got to pay a bit of his wages. Well, it's better than losing him for free. There we go, Alex off, and that could give us all what we needed. He was a bench player last year. Didn't do anything for us. So that's a great bit of business if it works. All right, that's just might have saved us a few quid actually. Another centre back in. Right, I should go and loop for a goalie. Ah, right, okay, mate. So, oh, so you've just started, you're in season one. And you'll sell a couple and it will be all right. Nice, mate, nice.
Right. Um, 6 2 Burnley. <laughs> Joe Linton and Isaac, the new third, that new sharer. Nice, mate. Nice. <laughs> Right, that's not happening. Um, oh, I know I want. I know I want. I know I want. Ah, uh, that's who I would have liked. Right, so. Nice, mate. So you got Austria in the last 16. You still all right? I thought you might have finished it. <laughs> Your old Gavin Northgate. <laughs> Hmm. I'm blaming the keeper. Well, right, the next World Cup will be your last. Right, fair one, mate. Fair one. <laughs> I'm not seeing much better than what we've already got here. Trotman would be the one. But we haven't got eight million. Oh, hang on, let's take that off. Duh. <laughs> I want Jordan. That's who I want. Even for a year. Trotman ain't coming. Villa Lawrence requested a move. Four point four. Is he really much better? I know we haven't got a decent keeper. Technically better. Uh, right, right. What what year are you up to? Because you've done a few tournaments now, haven't you? Why do you want 40 grand a week, mate? Right, not happening. Keeping the goalie. <laughs> I'm going to go for Jordan on loan. That's what I need to do. Yeah. 
if he's not on loan at Coventry for the season, of course. I'm hoping he was on loan last year. Which he was. We asked, we asked Chelsea about eight times last summer. Please give me Jordan. No, no, no. First team commitments at Chelsea. And then they loan him to Coventry. Talk about being sent to Coventry. Never a nice thing. <sighs> Only buying him because he's Welsh. Not going to lie. <laughs> So it's going to be an interesting 1st of July. We've got about 18 players coming in. Alex, he's gone. That's a huge one. He was awful for us. Ta-da, mate. Thanks for the millions. First of July, nice. All right, they've said I can have five mil of it, mil of it, but that really helps this club out. Sending a player, one player a year, if we can get rid of one for twenty million plus. And the two I've got rid of, which I'm more than happy with, uh, the right winger in Hyde, never played five million, twenty grand a week saved. Alex was only on about four grand, so it wasn't his wages. But to bring in 26 million plus add-ons um, for a player what was going to go in a year's time for free, that, that could change everything at this club. And we're bringing in 942 players in a few days' time. Yeah, we do all that. Yeah, keep it the same. If you bugger up, I will find you. I love to find people. Uh, I'm confused, Fi. I've read that three times. I'm not sure what you mean, mate. I do apologise. The income one, bottom left, your heart ache between and during games. You've lost me, mate. Sorry, I do apologise. Right, so on the finance, uh, on the income,
Oh, right. I'm with you now, mate. I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you. Took me a second. Apologies, five. Apologies. I was like... I kind of I couldn't work out what you meant. I see what you're saying now. Yeah, you can see the spikes. Yeah, <laughs> but it, it we we've we've got to do it. We have to do it, at Cardiff. We can't hoard players like I did at Bath. We have to get rid, get more in. And we, yeah, we're gonna have over fifty million in the account before we start the season. <sighs> Will they let me actually buy someone? I have bought a couple this summer, to be fair. But I need to look at the squad. We need to get it the 1st of July before we look any further. All oh, right, well, you went to Cholton, not me. Ta, don't ask again. Guy Washington is Belgium. Not in English and Belgium. Fair enough. Jim's done his groin on the first day of training. Christ, I've been that busy. I've literally had one beer. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it was his groin. Oh, I don't know who's playing around down there. <laughs> There we go. First pre-season done. Ah, oh, sorry. Uh, first pre-season game is just about to start. Right, sweet, sweet, sweet. So, Christ. Um, hour and 43 minutes. Oh, my eyes are hurting. My eyes are hurting. <laughs> so, after an hour and 43 minutes, we're going to take a little break so I don't have to look at the screen no more. Ah, I love pre-season, but my eyes don't. So, go and get the kettle on. Yes, get yourself a coffee.
Just close them. That's it, yeah. Who's playing where? <laughs> Uh, go and get your kettle on. Go and get yourself a coffee. Do what you got to do. And I will see you back here. I'd say in about five minutes or more. Proper break. I can't believe we're actually on an hour and 44 minutes. Well, it's an hour and 45 minutes by the time I hit this button. So there we go. I will see you in about five minutes. Thanks for watching. Do appreciate it. Cheers, cheers, cheers.
Hello and welcome back to the Tough Mountain Show, part two. <laughs> Hope you all do well and refreshed. <laughs> I got to stop buying players for a minute. We can keep Julian now. We can keep him because of what we've done. Sorry, mate. Can you just disappear? Um, Char, that's good. That's good. Right, small squad. That's all right, though. Oh, Finn wants a new contract. Well, you're not going to be happy when you're going to be number two next year, mate. All right, Emil Sutherland. Just stick the hussy and we want Ronda. So, Ole. Julian's just made it. Uh, uh, well, we're going to stick with Jack on the right. It's his second year. I want... It's, it's a toss-up between him and Power. Murray, Robbo. Happy days. Marsh. So we've got young John. Doogie, Nathan. Danny. Happy days. Power. And then the new, the new Brazilian up top. Uh, 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 uh. Damn, done well last year out on loan. Could be a decent player for us this season. Now, Walsh, who, yeah. Oh, no, actually. Well, Lloyd's going to go out on loan. So, yeah, we'll stick with that. Well, she... Right, oh, I'm looking for a striker, looking for a striker. It do, it do. It doesn't matter. The team's going to look a lot different before next week's game against Salford. So I could go hussy left doogie, but I don't want to. Power. Everyone else is young. Look at that bench. 23, 20, all right, 30, 19, 30. Uh, 
Oh, Ruddy Roddicks. Right, there we go, there we go, there we go. First, our friend Ali against Burry. Haven't changed the tactics. I hope you were sat down when I said that. <laughs> Might do. I want all the players in. So let's get past 1st of July. Play the way we play for now. To be fair, we hit the playoffs in the first season, nine points off from last year. So hopefully with the new players in, a lot of youth, but we've got new centre-backs coming in. I can get Jordan in goal. So it's good. I'm actually quite chuffed that the first game we get to see the old boys play first. Pray. Let's pray for a better start to the season than what we had last time. <laughs> yes, mate. Uh, no, not the young boys. <laughs> the old boys, as in the old boys in the squad. Most of them are kids, but yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no, we've had to let Desmond go. We've had to let him go. Didn't turn up for work three days in a row. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and Cardiff was skint, so I thought, I can't give Desmond another contract. <laughs> so, yeah, I suppose a goalie left back would be the two places I'd like out of the players on the pitch. But then again, Burry are beating us. <laughs> Yo, Murray's an Irish and he's a D. Hey! We we'll press the button because we haven't tonight. If it was the Lost Boys, you'll be a bit worried. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> me too, fine. Me too. <laughs> right, they're only going to play about 55 minutes. And then I'll take him the lot off. A oh, hussy. He never scores. And he does a little Irish jig to celebrate. 98. <coughs> Right, I'm not going to take off Robbo just yet. I want... Because uh, the new lad's going to be coming on. Right. <laughs> Lost Boy is a vampire movie. I wouldn't have known that five, but I know you're not shocked to hear that. 
<laughs> Lost Boys is also the Spurs defence. <laughs> Unless they're playing Everton every week. <laughs> I can't believe Paddy Power paid out already on Everton getting relegated after two games. That's brilliant. I'd never... It'd be funny if Everton go down this year. Uh, moving into their new stadium in the Championship would be hilarious. <laughs> but... I never, ever want Everton to go down because I love the Merseyside derby. And it's an easy six points for Liverpool every year. As it looks like an easy six points for the whole Premier League at the moment. <laughs> they won't go down, no. I don't think they will, mate. And most of their heads are in Man United's wardrobe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I to write Everton off under Dice. I just Dice knows how to get teams out of trouble. I know he took Burnley down in the end, but I mean, did Dice say in a con? Uh, in did he not say in a press conference the other day? What am I supposed to do? We've got no money. I'm I'm, I'm hopeless. I need help. Um, I think that sums up Everton. If the takeover goes through and they get a couple of quid. They should be all right. Yeah, for sure, mate. And uh, when Man City get 115 points dot, there's only two teams what can go down. <laughs> Yeah, I think they'll be fine as well, mate. I do, I do. But Paddy Power paid them out to get relegated. Someone sent Dice a care package. <laughs> oh, one of the funniest things Sean Dice ever said was, I think it was on Soccer AM when it was good back in the day. And they asked him what he was writing on his pad. But he went, to be honest, a load of bollocks. This just looks good for the cameras. <laughs> that made me chuckle, that did. Fair play for your honesty. <laughs> yeah. We're sending a pack of biscuits. <laughs> Right, let's get to the 1st of July. It's one or oh, what? Eight players coming in. Wimbledon knocked out Ipswich in a shootout. Newcastle beat Forest in a penalty shootout. <laughs> yeah, animal crackers and the former Liverpool players. <laughs> oh, brilliant, mate. Brilliant. Well, they said we're come 14th and we got 9th, so. Rexham and Swindon went down. Oh, no, I don't know that. I don't know that. I just made that up. Wrexham and Swindon survived. Reading did have a 12-point deduction and they still didn't finish bottom of the league. Oxford did. And we've just sold someone to Oxford for five mil. There we are, the official end of that season. Now we go into the next one. It's five. I know it went one all. That was the last time I saw the card for result. Was one all, but he lost five three to Southampton in the end. I always thought Southampton would beat them, to be fair. Sheffield Wednesday at home. I 
there we are, into the new season, officially. It's season 23, I think. Right, Marsh wants to have a year out, so let him go. And I'll backtrack on. Never find it. Where is the the bless be Derby? Yes, mate. <laughs> you never know, mate. You never know. Why can't I find it on this game? Player status. Can't be there. I used to know where it was. It won't be under any of them. It's got to be under development. It's bugging me now because I can't ever bloody find it. Oh, no way, mate. I've done 10 more years. Oh, God. Oh, you would be. Um, you know when you change the status of a player, like uh, no longer wanted, star player, average player, squad player, used to be in here. Like, I've never found it on FM24. Ah, uh, it's driving me mental. Can't be any of that. Can't be any of that. Used to be like on here, transfer status. And you could just change it. Not needed, backup keeper, first team keeper and all that malarkey. The only way I ever see it is when my... um. Assistant tells me in a press conference. Because I've got him down, he's not needed. I just want to change it to backup keeper. Can't be any of that. Information on here. Fair one, mate. Fair one. I always knew where it used to be, um, but I can't find it anywhere on here. Because we've got him down is not needed. I just want to put him back as backup keeper. It's obviously not under profile. Attributes. Sod it. Let's uh, click on every option we got. Happiness. It's just a press of a button on the console. Fair one, mate. 
So that's agreed playing time. Well, uh, that's the agreed playing time. Is that what it is? It's the agreed playing time. Right, because in the old games, it was slightly different. Um, it was literally under... You could do it under, like, transfer status and stuff and change it, but... It's not that worried. Uh, 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 uh. We do it on agreed playing time. I know I had it last year with a player and it done my nutting. <laughs> it's been doing my nutting since it come in the game come out. We start at home to Swindon, Ipswich away, Birmingham, trip to Wrexham and then Leeds. Southampton have been docked 12 points before balls being kicked. All right, let's have a cheeky look at their squad. Preston want everyone. <laughs> <laughs> so he's going to be better than my keeper. <laughs> yeah, Gary South Southampton. <laughs> I'm only looking at him because he's Welsh. <laughs> right, right. I can't find anyone. Um. Oh, Cardiff and Swansea under 18s will be hitting it together. Where are West Brom now? West Brom are back in. What? Oh, that's all right. That's all right. I thought they went back to non-league then. 
Try to put us in the top ten. That's better. I hope. That's a few places up from last year. We need to get through to here next Saturday. Oh, we can't have any fans in at the game because we've got 800 players signing. <laughs> A whole stand will be taken up. <laughs> oh, I forgot about Alvin. Done all right, Dolwich. I'm just trying so hard not to buy anyone else right now. <laughs> Trying so hard not to sign players, and the first thing he does is go and sign some more. <laughs> if he didn't play for Liverpool, I probably wouldn't even have looked at him. Everyone in football wants him. We're going for him. Two more. <laughs> oh, we're all right this year, bless me. We've sold big players. <laughs> Is that what it says? Oh, I love the fact that you spot stuff like that, mate. You always do. We do need a left back. Whoa. Oh, right. Okay, mate. Fair one. I've just got him because he's Liverpool and he, you know, he's a bench warmer. I'm not thinking of the first team. I'm just thinking if we could resell him. But he looks a decent player. He's not interested in us. <laughs> right. Uh, he doesn't want to come, but if he's got nowhere to go in a week's time, you never know. He might change his mind. Yeah, but if he ends up being without a club in a week's time, we could end up going back in for him. Right, let's bring the players in we've got. We've got a lot of players coming in. <laughs> let's, let's see what the squad's like on Monday morning before we do any more buy-in. <laughs> what? Well, Man City, no, no. Harry's been with me since Bath, I think.
Bar Thunder 18s. We had him at Madrid. You dare, Harry. You dare. I'm not going to ask him to stay because every time you do, they always leave. <laughs> We've had him forever, mate, haven't we? He's a former Orient player. I wouldn't have known that, mate. I wouldn't have known that. <laughs> He really is all about pace and pace and nothing else, isn't he? He might be all right off the bench. He might be all right off the bench. <laughs> That's nine coming in, I think. Getting close, getting close. <laughs> I know where we'll be on Monday, then. Oh. oh, dear. I nearly choked them. Arsenal have offered me an interview. <laughs> Arsenal want me back. I was a favourite player. I was a fav fan favourite, a favourite personnel. Not an icon. Really, I should be on the legends list after winning the uh, European Cup for them and the Europa League. <laughs> yeah. Fine, look away now as we go back to the Gunners. <laughs> but last season, we were a favourite personnel. <laughs> I can't go back to Arsenal. I don't even know why I'm looking. Decline. Done. <laughs> I was never going. Yeah, he done well at Bolton last year. We'll let him go back. We'll let him go back. Yeah, breaking news. He will not go back to Arsenal. It's not worth the grief. <laughs> uh, imagine Fye coming on and he'd be like, you're Arsenal again. What? <laughs> I was going to do something before the Arsenal job. I can't remember what it was. Oh, no, it's pointless until tomorrow. We've done our time at Arsenal. We won't talk to the press about it. We're walking away. Oh, no way, mate. <laughs> oh, that'd be quality, mate. Yeah, I didn't even know his son was playing football. That'd be awesome, mate, if you get him. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's it. I know what I was doing.
All right, he was at Watford, and then he's gone to Giroud. All right, you think. Right, fair one, mate. Oh, Harry, snub Man City, just like me last season. So since I've been at Cardiff, I've turned down Man City. I've turned down Arsenal. <laughs> I know he wants a new deal. Pfft, he is not getting that. He ain't getting 21 grand either. That's fully charged. Happy days. That's it, mate. Harry staying with us. He's been from Bath to Madrid and he's staying. Oh, to get James again. But I'm not having Zavi phoning me up every other week moaning. No. Eight signings. Ah. <laughs> uh. Right, so overall, most of them are decent. Most of them are decent. Forty-one million in the coffers. Come on. Right, we knock it down to ten mil. And we've got under grand to spend on wages. Well, we've got a squad. <laughs> I think we can reduce some defenders. John done all right last year. Right, now I need to go to Chelsea. Jordan Griffiths. Jordan Griffiths. Come on. 
Come on, Chelsea, you're rich. Right, I'm accepting it. I don't care. I want Jordan in goal next year. Yes, he's coming. He's coming. If we can get a deal done. Oops. I'm just going to accept it, I think. Minimum, that's fine. Non-promotion, that's fine. Sell on, yeah, whatever. That could be a hell of a two sign-ins. Hell of a two sign-ins. I'd like to bring Lawrence back from Man U. I don't know if that's even possible. Turner's good, but we've got to know what we've got. I don't really know why he's there. Come on, Jordan Griffiths. We got a B minus. We've got a C plus. And we've got Salford. <laughs> so I've got to work out all this lot now. Right, right, right. Harris. Hmm. Your bits, your bits, your <laughs> Welcome bits. back, Josh. Up, Hope you your enjoyed bits. your dinner, buddy. Hope you enjoyed your dinner. <laughs> Right, we've made some heads and tail out of all that, just about. We could switch it a bit, but they've only signed today. So we're going to let the other lads go out first. 
The old boys, not the young boys. <laughs> so no new sign-in start. Well, that's good. That's all good. Literally signed today. They're on the pitch, waving to the crowd. Right, I'm going to the bar while the teams are warming up. Oh, I missed a goal. <laughs> Hussey scored again. He doesn't score goals. Robbo, get in, mate. Get in. Oh, the old lads are going, my God, there's a lot of players here now. We need to pull our finger out. If we can get that right winger, though, and that goalie, that really does sort me out. This Husey could go through the middle, then. I know I've made him a right winger. Could do her a left back. I like Ronda though. I do like Ronda. He's not let me down. And he's from the academy. So, if I don't get a left back, we stick with here. Yeah. Obviously, you can't read anything into beating Salford and Borough. Burry, Burry, sorry. There we go. I want Jack through the middle. And he's just put it into the bottom, uh, into the net. Got a goal. Where is Mohawk? Let's have a look at the heat map. Says a lot that. Right, making wholesome changes, wholesome changes here. Oh, 
<laughs> Not sure about the keeper though. Especially if we get Jordan. So, the man from Liverpool will make his debut. The man from Alkmaar will make his debut. Doogie. Williams, who you could argue should have started, but he's a centre-back. We're playing him left-back tonight. Put a bit of power in the midfield for Ole. Bit of me wants to play Philippe a bit further up the pitch, but for now, that will do. Condal, now officially our player. We had him on loan last year. Jonesy. I believe that's Kelly Jones's son from the Stereophonics. Yes, I did just make that up. <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. That's good. Ten substitutions. I'm going to allow the keeper to play 90 minutes. Just in case the other lad comes in. I'm starting to get excited now. I really am, because I've got something to work with. A tough six months since January, but selling Alex, selling Chris, it's Good working bits. out. Your bits. Your lovely, lovely bits. The tough man loves your bits. <laughs> <laughs> cheers, 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 Josh. <laughs> Gives me an excuse to get the rolling cheers out as well. <laughs> I like Philippe. He looks a decent player. Another Brazilian. We're trying to sell shirts in Brazil. Your bits. Your bits. Your lovely, lovely bits. The tough man loves your bits. You think the chat's not working? I've just refreshed everything. No, no, I think the chat room is all right, Josh. I've just double checked. Hello, Game Messiah's got here. Yeah, it's all working, I think, Josh. You panicked me then. <laughs> I thought it was all going to crash again. It wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> I'm good. Cheers, buddy. How are you? <laughs> Hello, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> no, not if I do that. I can't see a thing now. Oh, hello. <laughs> but no, it has been known to crash. So I think it's only happened, I reckon, two, maybe three times in the last year and a half. We got, oh, Liverpool got West Ham. Home or away? Home or away? I looked at my phone, it would probably tell me. Liverpool, Man City, Man United and Arsenal handed home ties in the third round of the Carabao Cup. And we get West Ham at home, I'm, I'm guessing, from that. Well, what a... You got Barnsley, Barnsley. We're Barmy, we're from Barnsley. We're gonna win the cup. I'll never forget that song ever. <laughs> when I uh, I watched Cardiff in the FA Cup semi final. Aaron Ramsey was only a kid. Um, 
and me and my uncle got on a train in London. Uh, is it Paddington, the main one, I think? We stayed in the Hilton at Paddington. We, my uncle got a deal on it. It wasn't money. It was just lucky. Um, and we got on the train to Wembley, and we were the only two people with Cardiff shirts on. The whole carriage was just red of Barnsley, and they just stood there singing all the way to Wembley. We're Barnsley, we're Barmy, we're going to win the cup over and over again, pointing at me and my uncle. And in the end, me and my uncle joined in. <laughs> We're like, you're Barmy, you're from Barnsley. You're not going to win the cup. <laughs> my uncle got a ticket for the final as well. I didn't, unfortunately. He, um, and uh, that's when Portsmouth won the cup. That's when Portsmouth won it, I think. Right, I want a friendly for everyone else here. Aw, oh, I nearly hit Wrexham. Oh, let's play the vegans. The forest green of vegans. Vegans. And many moons ago, uh, in Forest Green, where they're staging in, I think it's Knowsley, I think they're staging in. And uh, I used to clean their drains. <laughs> your bits, your bits, your lovely, lovely bits. That's <laughs> my love. Nice bits. one, Josh. Nice one. <laughs> but yeah, I worked for Gloucester Council for like, oh, well, I, well my firm was con, con, worked for Gloucester Council. And whenever they had a boy, uh, when, when everyone was sick or on leave, I used to fill in for the council boys. Best job I ever had. Sat in a van, drive 50 miles, fill up a pothole, drive another 50 miles, fill a pothole up, have lunch. <laughs> you know, it's <was> brilliant. <laughs> and one of the jobs was to go to Forest Green's ground and we had to clean the drains. Uh, unfortunately, it wasn't a nice job. It was all full of needles because of heroin addicts. Um, so it wasn't a nice job. Uh, but yeah, it was great. Yeah, we had big protective gloves, these special shovels and all sorts. It wasn't nice. But we're talking 98, 99. Uh, I don't know if that area is better or not. I couldn't tell you. I think they've moved ground since then and they're looking to build again. Uh, but Rob, who I used to work with in, in my main job I'd done for 20 years, massive Forest Green fan. The only bloke I've ever met in my life with a Forest Green um, jersey on. <laughs> right, to the press box. Oh, I'm chuffed that we got these players in, John. Oh, for sure at 20, we're looking uh, for the future, Ian. I believe he can. We wouldn't have brought Sean in if we didn't think he could. No, no, he's going to be great for us. Experience. You never know. You never know. Sean will settle in well. I believe he knows quite a, uh, quite a lot of the young lads. Whew. Right, that's why I added the other friendly in. I want to play the other lads against Forest Green. And for some reason, our affiliated club is older shot. He keeps coming up, this man. He keeps coming up. He's a Jamaican. I didn't know that. Not like that matters. Um, before I got it. Oh, perfect game, Messiah. That would have been the lawn ground. They moved to the, the new lawn around 06. 
Yeah, I yeah, yeah, that yeah, that makes absolutely perfect sense, buddy. Oh, yeah. And I think it was literally next door as well, if I remember rightly. But as I said, long time ago. Up a big hill. Really up a big hill. And it was on the left hand side. But they're looking to build a new stadium. Um, which is opposite the council yard I used to work in with uh, on the M5. I don't know if they got it's gonna be a complete green stadium as well, isn't it? Oh, we got a meeting. We're off to a meeting. Two of the lads. So two Bournemouth players, two Liverpool players. Happy days. Is that an Eco Park? Right, right, right. I'm glad you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I would like to go back in for Farrell. Not at that wage, though. <laughs> made of wood. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, definitely, mate. <laughs> Should go down well. But I know I've seen the aerial photos. You don't even see the ground. It's like they've got grass on top of their stadium. So it just looks like a field and stuff. That is quite impressive, to be fair. Right, if this bloke asks for 50 grand, he can do one. I oh, won't get a work permit. All right, end of that. Who are you? Crossing 15, flare 16. Hmm. Nope, not at 44 grand a week. 34 grand. You're having a Tim Bubble Bath, mate. I'm not having that. I've already assigned my uh Oh, nice one, the FM Daddy. Says, Thank you for the raid. <laughs> oh, thank you, the FM Daddy. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Appreciate it, buddy. Appreciate it. How are you doing, mate? Hope you're well. The tough man, ten. Oh, thank you for the follow as well. Uh, Nuxi, I hope I've got not got your right name wrong. Uh, yeah, I'm good, mate. I'm good. Nazi. Sorry. Sorry if I've got you. I'm worse than Paul Mercer than it names. I apologise. Thank you for the follow. Oh, I'm glad you're good, mate. I'm glad you're good, buddy. I forgot what I was doing now. You've uh, thrown me, but I appreciate it. <laughs> we are in the middle of pre-season with Cardiff. Oh, my. He's a decent player. We've sold half the squad. I've got money. I can't believe it. No. Nope. Not being held to ransom. Not being held to ransom. How's your stream go, bud? I uh, hope, you, hope you had a good stream, mate. Right, both of them, they're all good. Let him go where he wants to go. <laughs> yes, mate, a little bit. Oh, another meeting. Um, end meeting. Done, 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 done. So, yeah, we had, we were bankrupt in January. 
Uh, and I've I've sold 30, 30 odd million pounds worth of players this summer. It's been a good window so far. We've brought in a load of free players. We've made good money. Um, there's a few more at the end of last season. And Chris went. So we're slowly getting there with Cardiff. We're slowly getting there. It's been a long journey. Ever since we left Real Madrid. So it's going to be our second full season with Cardiff. Last year we fell apart massively. That's it, mate. That's it. You know, we sold Alex. He was not going to sign a new deal, Alex. So to get 20... Well, is it 32 million with add-ons? Thank God for that. Oh, my. I've been waiting for nearly two years for this signing. We've got your young Jordan Griffiths. I made him Welsh's number one goalie when I was the national team boss. Yeah, definitely, mate. Definitely. I'm not getting attached to players like I've done in the past. But I've got Jordan Griffiths in. I'm over the moon with that signing. Wonder Kid goalie. Oh, I've been waiting a year for this signing. Unbelievable. <laughs> as long as it took Arsenal to get the new lad from Shoshia dad I won't pretend I know his name <laughs> but to bring him in I gave him his debut at Wells I am chuffed chuffed to bits that's just the difference between him and Finn are night and day absolutely oh, we're going to have a good season Oh, I feel it. I feel it in my fingers. Um, still third. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's put us up. They predict ninth where we were last year. <laughs> I am so chuffed to get Jordan in. All we need now is that right winger from Newcastle. There we go. All right, let's bring him in. <laughs> I've never been so happy before. Well, we've said it before, if a player, no, we're not going to try to hump. If I say stay, they leave. If I leave it, they stay. I'm caught here. We need a left back. But Ronda is, super, he's never let me down from the academy. I really don't know what to do. I don't really want to replace him. He's definitely getting a new deal. <laughs> Fair one, Josh. That makes sense. To improve... Ronda's the best trainer at the club. He's a left back with a right foot. <laughs> Work that one out on a Tuesday. <laughs> oh... I just chuffed we got Jordan. Oh, my. Well, we've looked at him. He wanted too much money. So, do one. Mm, I like, I like, I like. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> yeah, it took two months, but you got your man. I would like to go for you, but if we get that Portugal's guy, it's pointless bring him in. in. So I'm going to put him on my list to look at in a future moment. Is, is he still, is he signed yet, Josh? Or is it still ongoing? I know it's close. I know it's going to happen. Um, but has it actually happened yet? Uh, done medical signed, you think? Fair one, mate. Fair one. It, yeah, that's what I sort of picked up on from um, Sky Sports News and whatnot. Right. I want to play everyone. We basically signed the whole list here. <laughs> Oh, really, Game Messiah? Fair one. Mendes in the... Uh, uh, yeah, Zambadini, or however you pronounce it. <laughs> they love to put up the United, yeah. <laughs> so if we can get a right winger... And a left back... My business is done. Two Brazilians in the squad too. All right, Nathan, John, Charles. Well, oh, yeah, those two will go. That's fine. Not a problem. <laughs> we got Jordan Griffiths. We've got Jordan Griffiths. Oh, that's a game changer for the season. We've got a goalie. Couldn't get one last season. We had to play Finn. Jordan's a different kettle of fish. Oh, dear. I'm over the moon. <laughs> oh, it means I'm not changing the formation. <laughs> Easy for you to say. <laughs> Not really sold on a former Newcastle player. <laughs> Right, most of these are new signings. See how they go on. Oh, Felipe! Pick that out of the net. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine new lads out there. Um, I heard today that you've gone for Ben Chilwell. I don't know how much of that is true, but because Luke Shaw and, oh, I forget his name, Josh, I do apologise. It's just smoke, is it? Ah, right. I did read today that because Shaw and the other lad are injured, that they're going to bring in um, Chilwell. <laughs> Game Messiah doesn't like a hipster. <laughs> oh, 
I'm just staring at Jordan Griffiths. Oh, I know I keep saying it. <laughs> Malaki. If only he was as good as uh, Nunes, eh? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, there's a, yeah. <laughs> there's a, that was from Discord earlier. Josh was winding me up about Zakiri. <laughs> Zachary, sorry, Zachary. Uh, yeah, he's, he's just a poor man's Nunes. <laughs> that was a joke from Discord earlier. <laughs> but yeah, Chilwell and a host of other players. It could be crazy, couldn't it? How many players Chelsea sell before the deadline? Or they're or they've got an unbelievable under twenty one side. Oh, honestly, when I started tonight, I didn't know if I was going to stay at Cardiff. That is the honest truth. I didn't know. I knew I had to sell and sell and sell before I could buy, buy, buy. Um, and it's worked out well. I've still managed to keep. I'm not happy that he's on 64 grand a week, but he's a top player. They are, mate. They are. They are. God, they could make 100 odd million more, couldn't they? Ah, oh, Jan's got an early goal for the club, the Brazilian. <laughs> top, 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 top player from Brazil. <laughs> Very true, mate. Yeah, I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. <laughs> but Chelsea will come good, won't they? You know, I'll be gobsmacked if they don't. I'm not saying they're going to come good straight away. But you can't buy £1.3 billion worth of players and stay awful. Something has to click. I'm gobsmacked that they got rid of Pochettino. I really was surprised. There must have been something going on above. Um... Obviously, the Italian lad, I'm not even going to pronounce his name, the new manager. Done very well at Leicester, of course, winning the title. He's been with, you know, worked under Pep. I know he didn't do well in his first job. But to come back to Leicester and win the league like he did, I know they had a good team. They are a relegated team, but he still had to do it. Fair one, mate. Fair one. Uh, where's Jordan Shan uh, Sancho going to end up? Because he's still there, isn't he? Swap deal for Sterling. <laughs> How would you feel if Raf and Sterling ended up at Man United, Josh? You'll cry. <laughs> so what, Chelsea top four? Uh, you did say that in the start of the season. That was one of your predictions, Game of Sire, for sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. I just don't know what's going to happen at Chelsea. I really don't. I like your confidence, though, mate. Especially as you're an Arsenal fan. <laughs> That's good confidence. But they should be top four with the money they spent, the players they've got. And if that manager gets them going, I just can't think of his name. And I'd probably get it wrong if I could. Um, Nunes isn't leaving Liverpool. Confirmed. 
Breaking news on the tough man, Sancho. Nunes isn't leaving Liverpool to Arsenal for 73 million. Rashford and Sterling on the wing. I really want Sterling to go to Man United now, just for Josh. <laughs> <laughs> I know he come out in the press and went, oh, I love my time at Liverpool. I loved it. I'd love to go back. Yeah, you would say that now, wouldn't you, mate? We're not giving you 300 grand a week, you greedy little... You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, no... Preston have gone in for Fabrico. One of my last. No, no, uh, but the press did say Nunes, 73 million to Arsenal, I read earlier, on Sky Sports app. So it wasn't just silliness. And I was like, really? Really? Well, I'll take that. <laughs> Sterling's a United fan. Is that what you're saying, Josh? Or have I read that wrong? <laughs> right, press conference to welcome Jordan. Oh, uh, I am over the moon. He's a quality player and I can't believe he's come to us. I'm delighted he's here for a year. Yes. Oh, the whole squad, honestly, when he walked in to the training ground, everyone clapped. Oh, he's come here to play football, Adam. That's why Jordan's here. And, and we get on very well. Oh, look, 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 look. Let's not go down that route. We've got him for a year. I'm sure he will. He is a leader. He's got a voice for a young man. Well, it's my job to get the most out of him. Yep. <laughs> oh, gay messiah. <laughs> Two washed up wingers and a hits direct front. Look behind you, it gets worse. Harry Maguire. Yeah, <laughs> look on the touchline, you might die. Oh, what is your nickname for Tag Hag? <laughs> I forget, I forget. Oh, Josh isn't happy. He's taffed you off. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I've got the giggles now. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're all jokes aside now. Eric Dyer got in the Brian Munich team above De Litt. Doesn't that worry you, Josh? All jokes aside. All jokes aside. Bin bag, that was it. Derek Tin bin bag. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it, Josh. Go for it. <laughs> Derek Tin Pinder. They did. They did do a petition. You're right, mate. You're right. <laughs> but yeah, that wasn't a, that wasn't me knocking the lit. Uh, you know, to come through was it Ajax go to Juventus for seventy five mil, whatever it was. Um, then get sold to Munich for a lot of money again. Oh, 
Well done, Charlie. Charlie, stay in with us. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, that, that's the one thing we've been talking about, the fact that Eric Dyer was in front of the lit, which is weird. If he's that good. <laughs> they just got Harry's mate in, didn't they? That's all they done. It, yeah, he's going somewhere, isn't he? He's definitely going somewhere now that they brought... Uh, is Lukaku confirmed? Um, but yeah, he's definitely going somewhere. Oh, Shimon. I don't even know how to say his name. <laughs> Dancer's favourite player, Dyer. <laughs> I'll let him know when I see him... Uh, I think on Friday. I'll let him know, mate. He... <laughs> Dog shit dyer, his dancer calls him. <laughs> yeah, I... I... <laughs> yeah, um, I'm surprised that... I know Game of Cyrus talking about Ivan Tony going to Chelsea earlier. I'm surprised people haven't gone in for him. <laughs> Right, that's uh, we should sort of put the first team together now. I want the Dutchman there, Williams. I think, even though he's a centre half, I think we're going to keep him left back. So that gives me. Liverpool lad, Hussey, Summers, and Hughes is back up. Happy, happy there. Ole comes in. And so does Julian. I still think I should sell Julian, but. We'll see. We'll see. Right. So, Jack. Wayne Rooney wants him. We keep saying no. But you got to think, Jax, Welsh international. Stefan won the Euros with Croatia and played a whole half. I'm hoping it's a good day, like the old school deadline days. Me and Fi were talking about it. Uh, let's hope it's a good deadline day like it used to be. It'd be awesome. Uh, and we got Peter, Irish international. Liam. Irish International. I'm happy now. We've got a decent back, back up back four. Power. How is Felipe not in the team? I can't believe we got £40 million in the bank. What I'm going to do quickly is look at facility. So we know the youth system's going up. Ground's good enough. Right.
get the training facilities better. Cheers, bless me. Oh, oh, I'm over the moon that we've sorted it. I wanted to be at Cardiff for 10 years, but at the end of last season, it was getting really difficult. But we've done the right thing. We sold players I'm not using. We've made money. The, the whole window's been amazing. Uh, we brought players in, you know, all the way from Jan. Selling Chris was a big, Curtis even, was a big step in the right direction. Obviously, getting rid of Alex for 20, 32 and a half were add-ons. Unbelievable. But, we're, yeah, I feel we're closer now than we were before. Right, we do have a game. We've got older shot away. I used to drive past their ground every day. Shit all. Um, <laughs> I don't mean that rudely. <laughs> it's not a nice ground. So we're up to three hours and 22 minutes. So we're going to have a quick second break. We've only had one break. My God, it's gone fast tonight, hasn't it? I've loved every moment of it. I've loved the chat room. Uh, you've all been stars. So, let's have a five-minute break. Get yourself a Foster's. Bless me. Get yourself a coffee. Game Messiah. Get yourself whatever you want. <laughs> but we're going to take a wee break because my eyes need to go back to circles, not squares. And uh, I'm going to have to go and uh, walk around so my legs will work again. It's not great. Oxford is another awful one. <laughs> Fair one, mate. Fair one. Right. We'll be back in about five minutes, max. Till then, thanks for watching. The end of part two of the Taft Mountain Show. See you tomorrow.
welcome back to the Taft Mountain Show! Here live on a Wednesday still, just. <laughs> Bit quicker breaking I thought, but never mind. Off to older shot. <laughs> Reminds me of a story, I don't know if I can say it live. <laughs> I nearly got arrested in older shot for not paying a taxi. We had a taxi to go two miles and he charged us 15 quid. I just went, stop the taxi, mate. I ain't paying. Is a tenner. And you're lucky to get that. His boss then phoned me up. And What's the problem? I went, A, illegal taxi. B, you didn't show any badges at all. All your license. Nothing. C, to charge 15 quid to go two miles. No. Not having it. My mate got out the taxi and he fucking fell over on the floor, laughing his head off. He was like, how would you do that? I went, I'm not getting ripped off by anyone. <laughs> he went, my God, mate, you are Welsh at times. <laughs> and that was right by older shirts ground, that was. <laughs> oh, dear. I miss them times. <laughs> Then a really good friend of mine, he's been on the show, Tony, down in Plymouth. Um, he wrote his car off outside Older Shit's ground. Older, older Shot's ground. All right, come on. Like, Jack's eyeing this up, isn't he? Oh! Good. Come on! Pre-season or not, that's a goal to be cherished. My first signing at Cardiff, Jack was. He was literally a player what plays through the middle. We made him go on the right wing and he hasn't looked back since. <laughs> and what a great time in there. Jack knocks it across to Robbo. All us. All last pre-season, I was trying to find a striker. I couldn't buy one for love or money. And then we just put Robbo up front. And he hasn't looked back. 24 goals last year. He's going to hit it again this year. The Irish International. Hey, what's Jordan doing? <laughs> I think Van der Voort there. Van Voort, it'd be awesome as the ball playing centre back. It leaves Sutherland to do the defending. Ah, oh, Casado. I'm still tempted to sell him. Do you know what I'm? Do you know what I'm gonna do? Is offer him a new deal, mate. Reduce your wages. Look, total. I know it's older shot. I know it's older shot, but the whole team looks different. And we've got players on the bench now. We've got players on the bench. And as always, don't forget the chat room is open. No religion, no politics. Apart from that, let's have a chat. We're going to the top. Bluebirds! Bluebirds! <laughs> oh, let's not get too excited as it's only pre-season. <laughs> and we're playing older shot. <laughs> but I generally come on tonight thinking, do I stay at Cardiff? Do I leave? How the hell do I take a bankrupt club forward? And it's worked. Everything we've done is worked. Sold off players. To the tune of 40 million with add-ons. 
brought in loads of free players. The best signing in my eyes is Jordan Griffiths in goal. Unbelievable. I know his quality from the Welsh job. See? <laughs> Bit Welsh, yeah? Um, but Jordan was quality for me for Wales. Gave him his debut and he's going to shine for us. I know that. That's our centre-half, by the way. <laughs> and there's players on the bench who are good enough to start. We've never had that. We've literally re re relied on academy players. Not anymore. But I am relying on them still. The board have agreed to improve the youth system again, which is something I'm very fixated on. I want Welsh wonder kids. We got one in goal. I oh, yeah, praise them too much and that happens. Yeah, he's off any he ref. No. He had a great first year under me. Well, obviously we took over after 15 games in the first year. And Murray done really, really well for us in that first season. Um, your bits, your just bits. turning my fans on. Lovely, lovely bits. The tough man loves your bits. <laughs> cheers, Josh. Cheers, cheers, cheers. <laughs> I put a lot of eggs into that lad last year and he he won the Euros and he didn't do great for us last year but I believe him and I believe this year he's going to come good. The dirty Jim may not play. <laughs> if you know, you know. Right, we got a game in a couple of days so... 15 minutes, that will do. Well, 11 subs on the 50th minute. <laughs> yeah, Jim, the living, breathing tap off. Oh, he's had more red cards than I've had hot dinners. <laughs> I've never had a player sent off so much in my life before, I don't think. <laughs> but that first year, Jim hit like 11, 15 goals. What, 15, 20 assists? He's a good player, Jim, when he stays on the pitch. It's like we got Roy Keane, like, going through the middle. <laughs> and he deserved every red card, I'm not going to lie. It was dirty, dirty challenges. But I'm not reading that into this. We're playing older shot away. You can't read out into that. <laughs> Power played every game when I first took over. Ah, oh, Kundal's injured. Right. Oh, I'm going to have to work this. Stick him there. Hussey, right back. Play Doog. No, we won't. Sod it. Nathan, the star of the tournament for the Welsh youth in the summer. Let him play the ball rolling player. 
More like Kevin Musketing. Kevin Muscat. What a name. I've forgotten that name. <laughs> oh, brilliant. As always, Game Messiah. Kevin Muscat. Oh, my God. I want to say Bolton. I don't know why. I want to say Bolton. <laughs> Yeah, a dirty player going forward rather than a dirty midfielder. <laughs> you know what I like a good trivia fact on this show? Roy King made his debut in English football for Nottingham Forest and his last game for Manchester United in English football at what ground? Don't Google it. Don't Google it. I know the answer. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And the answer is Anfield. <laughs> he literally made his debut for Nottingham Forest at Anfield. <coughs> <coughs> And he made his last game for Manchester United at Anfield. Right, Josh, that's a long one. Barcelona currently can't proceed with Stefan due to the issues with financial fair play. Red Bull Charles will expect Stefan to travel on Thursday to complete a loan move. If nothing happens, Charles Berg hopes to get the deal done on Thursday. Nice, mate. Oh, well, I'd rather him go to Red Bull Charlesburg to, uh, under my assistant, uh, Pep, um, Linders. They know the player. <laughs> it's so cliche, isn't it? They know the player. But half a clock staff have gone to Red Bull Charlesburg. So if Brass goes there, brilliant. It'll get game time. Another player in my fantasy team who can't play football. <laughs> Ugate has completed his medical. Ugurt. I have no idea how you pronounce that, but Ugurt. <laughs> I'm going with Ugurt. I don't mean it nasty. <laughs> right, we've played rubbish teams so far, so. <laughs> he played for Palace Wolves, Rangers and Millwall and Australia. He was Australian. There's, a, there's so many bad challenges. There's a whole video on YouTube dedicated to him. <laughs> All right, I might have got it right. I might have got something right for once, Josh. <laughs> I don't know which one I got right though, the first one or the second. You get <laughs> And there we go, don't forget the fancy football league. Thirty two players. Um game week one, game week two, the second one. <laughs> both up on YouTube. I will get around to mentioning everyone. At some point. No, he's not for sale. Right. Well, I was going to offer him 50 grand a week. 
Fair play, fair play, mate. Take 40. <laughs> uh, you have 250 grand. Fair play. Nice. Yeah, just better than Casemiro. Why not, mate? Why not? So he's on 64 grand a week. We've got him down to 42 and a half. That's a big, big contract for us. Nice, nice. Reduced his wages as well. Not by a lot, but enough. Um, who's the other one on that list I want to sign up? It's Emule. That's important though. So he gets a pay rise by four grand. He loses a grand. He loses 20 grand. That's three massive players there. <laughs> He's not wrong with the pace. Just kidding. <laughs> so will they get rid of Casemiro now? Come on! We've got him. He's coming in. No, they're going to keep him. I know um, Kelleher 7. Uh, yeah, who I watched the United game with last week. You know him from the fantasy show. Uh, he's like, get rid of him. His legs are gone. Rubbish. Get Urgent in. Or better than Casemiro, as we're going to call him from now on. Um, he was like, yeah, please, get rid of him. <laughs> Oh my, oh my, oh my. What a player we've just brought in. On a free. <whistles> Only 24. <whistles> <laughs> I don't know why I'm listening. I don't know why I'm whistling. Um, That's an unbelievable signing. Unbelievable. Cheers, bless me. I am chuffed a bit. <laughs> Two hours to go. No. <laughs> no. You got to say that. No, 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 no. <laughs> what a player we brought in. So, what am I left to think about now? Keeper done, right back done, centre, centre. Okay, we could do a left back, but Ricardo could play there. I like Ole and Julian. That's fine. Jack will come into the middle. There's options there, especially with Jim back. Now, oh, I've got... Oh... Uh, Unbelievable, Jeff. Right, he's signed. He is signed. We're getting everyone we want. We're still under budget. 
So there's still scope to bring in a few players. It's going to be a great season next year. Unbelievable. I really believe that. Still ninth, but we've dropped five. We were 25 to one to win. We're now 20 to one. So we're doing the right things. We're doing the right things in the transfer market. Oh, monthly staff meeting. All right, I'm going to worry about that in a minute. Um... Don't worry about that. Yep. Good atmosphere at the club. Good, good. Good, good. I'm not going to stop going about it until I sign in. Ah, oh, here we go, mate. Here we go. We have to start to lose players as well. Um, oh, bringing in Fabrico is unbelievable business for Cardiff. Oh, for sure, he can make the difference in any game, Liam. Oh, we didn't have a problem on the right wing to start with. We have Jack Alex, but Fabrice is going to be brilliant. It's my job to get the best out of him. Unbelievable, Coop, for sure, Liam. Yeah, getting my tactics, fine. Of course he can. Right, couple of players out, couple of players in, another one out. I'm chuffed with Jordan, I'm chuffed with Fabrico. Oh, they won't do it. They won't do it. That's cool if that's what they want. I'd love to get Lawrence back. It's not going to happen. Don't. No. Your bits, your bits, your lovely, lovely bits. The tough man loves your bits. <laughs> Too kind, Josh. Too kind, as always. Thank you so much, buddy.
your bags, your bags, <laughs> your lovely, lovely bags. The top my loves, your bags. I don't want the right back. Her <laughs> tough my loves your bits. <laughs> Imagine getting him for free. I almost feel like I'm buying for the sake of it. Oh, mate, I hope so, bless me. I really hope so. I'm more confident now than I was before. Coming on tonight, I was like, what the hell? What the hell? I don't know what I'm going to do. But everything I wanted has come. I've, I haven't obviously got everyone I wanted. My gosh, it's been close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No way, no way, no way. Bluebirds! So... I wanted Jack through the middle. Jim's not back. I feel for some of them lads. I think they should be starting. Three games to go. <laughs> oh, we're going to have to add one last game in. We'll play Hibs before Swindon. So four friendlies to go. Happy days. Pre-season done. Well, fixture-wise. 
Yeah, I don't need 15 substitutes. 12 seems too many. I can't believe everything's gone so well. <laughs> oh, I've got a silly grin. I know I've got a silly grin for a reason. Oh, I know I keep saying it. I virtually think it when I come on tonight. I don't know if I can stay at Cardiff. There's no money. There's nothing I can do. Gonna have to reduce and sell and sell. Yes, mate. I've just got to let it go. Enjoy it while it lasts. I'm sure if that will screw me as always. <laughs> oh, hold on. I haven't pressed this button for a while. Hey, a bit of bow love, a bit of bow love. <laughs> but yeah. That definitely gave Messiah. It, I can't keep buying players. I know that. I know that. Um, but that overturn of the squad, overhaul of the squad, sorry, has been amazing. I've reduced players' wages. Everything's gone perfectly tonight. I'm so chuffed. We've got a new head physio, so no one's allowed a cold again. <laughs> Jack through the middle. <clears throat> oh, Fabrico straight away making an impact for a 7.4. And I still feel if I... I actually could go and spend £10 million on a player. Not going to. Not going to. But I could. Ah, oh, oh, who said that? Who said that? <laughs> Uh, Fabrice has done his ankle in the first 30 minutes of the season. Well, the pre-season. <laughs> it was going too well. <laughs> so, yeah, cheers, cheers, Josh. <laughs> Keeper, centre half, left back. Still quite a lot of lads what played last year. When they do things like that, why not play them? If we can get this stadium full for every game, wow, wow. That's going to give us a huge boost. <laughs> how you doing Reese? Good how are you doing, buddy? Hope you're well, hope you're well. Welcome in, welcome in. Up and off, up and off. <laughs> I'm not a Welsh speaking person. I am Welsh, but I'm not a Welsh speaking person. Do apologize, mate. <laughs> but I hope you're well. 
Yeah, <laughs> that. I'm not even sure that's Welsh, to be fair. <laughs> it probably is, but I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. Um, unfortunately, uh, my family moved to England when I was two. Born in Cardiff, Welsh father, but grew up in England. Blame my parents, not me. <laughs> right, let's make the subs. Gotta get flippy, flippy, flippy in more. Oh, mate, I was, uh, no, no, I, I wasn't born in England. I was born in Wales. But my when I was two, my family moved from Cardiff to Wiltshire. Uh, my mum's from Wiltshire. She was very homesick. So fair play to my dad. He went, right, we're going to Wiltshire just for my mum. So give my dad respect for that. Um, but, yeah, I was born in Cardiff, uh, but I grew up in England. Still not happy about it. <laughs> but you were born in England. Fair one, mate. Fair one. Yeah. Uh, oh, Christ. You're going back to 1980. A long time ago. Um, my dad met a Welsh girl. Uh, sorry, wrong way around. You moved when you were free. Fair one, mate. Fair one. Um, yeah, my mum met my dad. My mum moved to Wales. My mum hated it. She was on her own. She was homesick for her family. Uh, my dad joined the military at 21. Um, he was away all the time. So he went, I can't leave you in Cardiff with my family. It's not fair. Go back to your family. Um, so dad moved us all back to Wiltshire and uh, so my mum could be with her family uh, and then dad was off a lot, a lot through military work of course um, and we stayed in, uh, yeah, and uh, yeah. so I got, I, I grew up in Wiltshire, I grew up in England but I was born in Wales and then come to, then come to England um, Obviously, I've got no memory of that, being two. <laughs> but we always went back to Wales at least once, once a year minimum to see the family. If that makes sense. But you've got to give my dad, you know, I, I give my dad full fair play to him. He knew my mum hated Cardiff and wanted to come back to Wiltshire. He joined the military, as I said. And, uh, yeah, history's history. <laughs> and fair play to Dad for looking after Mum. <laughs> right, we signed him for Arsenal. No. Bring him in because he's free. But yeah, I spent um, a lot of time in Wales through work. Um, I ended up doing my dad's job, <laughs> which was weird. I'm, I'm ne I was just, I was never in the army. I just worked for him. Um, and yeah, Wales is an amazing place. I spent so much time there, the north to the south to the middle. Last year, I, I ended up in Newport and drove all the way past Snowdonia up till the very top left-hand corner and then drove along the coastline to Liverpool. 
beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Well chuffed with that. So we signed two of our best players. <laughs> I'm not surprised you've done that, Josh. <laughs> Uh, yep. <laughs> I think that got banned. I think that got banned, Reese. Um, but I'm going to allow it because I don't think it was that rude. <laughs> All Reese said was, sheep shagging bastards. We know what we are. We know what we are. Sheep shagging bastards. We know what we are. <laughs> I will allow it. I did allow it. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm laughing now. So, yeah, every now and again, you do hear a Welsh bit of my voice come out. <laughs> right. I need to turn that off. Do it by age. I know I can hit the automatic button, but Loads of scope in the team. And the great... Oh, oh just chuffed it. Look, we were bankrupt three months ago. Look at the money we've got now. <laughs> oh, mate. Um, I've been playing football manager games since... I'm just going to, I'm not quite sure what year I got into it, but we are talking like 1988. I'm 43, I turn 44 next month, and I've been playing football manager games since I was about eight years old, maybe seven. Um, my next door neighbour, who was about five years older than me, got me into it. He, he really did. We used to play games together on his Commodore Amiga. I think it was a Commodore Amiga. I can't remember. It was a long time ago. <laughs> so yeah, all the old platforms, the old championship manager, then it become football manager. I've been playing them all. Um, but I, what I never done was went streaming. Uh, my mod, Smokey Haze 8, my right hand man, um, 2008 was the first FM. LMA manager. Oh, I remember LMA. Game Messiah. I forgot about that. And obviously championship manager for sure. And the blokes what made championship manager, didn't they leave their jobs and set up football manager and had to wait 10 years or something along them lines? I think. Um, but yeah, so I've been playing football manager games for years and years and years. And Smokey Hayes, one of my uh, my mod, my only mod, um, he said to me a year and a half ago, Gareth, please stream Football Manager. I'm like, why? No one's going to want to watch this, mate. I'm just an idiot what plays a game. And he's like, no, mate, you'll be surprised. And yeah, the story's written after that. Everyone knows the story after that. I started and I loved it and I still love it and I'm still going. Um, it's been awesome. So yeah, uh, all, all a long time ago I started playing these games. Doesn't make I'm any better. <laughs> Doesn't make me any better at the game than anybody else. And game aside, will tell you, I'm very stubborn on tactics. <laughs> You didn't start till lockdown. Fair one. Fair one, Reese. Fair one. 
So who do you do? I didn't even know it was called Save a year and a half ago. It was a game. Apparently it's called a save. I never knew that. But um, I'm going to ask Reese, what is your save? What are you playing? What are you doing? The Way Warlord. Hey ho! <laughs> Hope I got your name right, mate. Hope I got your name right. The Way Warlord. The Way Ho! Oh, 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 I'm going to give up. I'm worse than Paul Merson at doing uh, names. You know that the more you watch. <laughs> but hey ho! Hope you're well, buddy. Hope you're well. Welcome in. Welcome in. <laughs> Does it, Gamer Site? It still holds up. I forgot all about LMA. I honestly forgot all about it. I used to love that game. I think someone said the other night, uh, is it Premier Manager? I remember playing that game a lot as well. I'm a journeyman, mate. I are. Uh, there we go. I'll show you an Aris, but... Um, I'm just going to let the club decide on the squad numbers. Oh. Me too, mate. I am a journeyman. So, I apologise for everyone that what knows my journey. <laughs> was it 05 to go 3D? It was on a PS1 as well. I think it was on a PS1. I played it as well, Game Messiah. So, yeah, for every new one who's in the room, apologise to everyone who's heard this before. We started FM 24 at Bath. We went from, as you can see, uh, the Conference South, and we went straight up. We went all the way to the Championship, and we couldn't get any further at Bath. I got very stubborn. I wouldn't sell players. Should have done. Should have moved them on. Made money. And I'm sure Bath would have got the Premier League. My mistake. My mistake. Um, Bath to Madrid. For sure, mate. For sure. <laughs> Fair one, mate. You're a Man United fan. Your Josh is a Man United fan, regular, regular in the room. Uh, great friend of the show. Um, that's cool, mate. No problem at all. I'm a Liverpool fan, Cardiff fan. Um, but that's cool. I'm sorry to hear about your medical issues. Um, I hope you are doing well. And yeah, I, I'm sorry to hear about that. Uh, but all fans are welcome. What we don't do is talk rubbish. We might have a wind up of each other. But we are real football fans and we talk proper football in here most of the time. <laughs> but yeah, we went to Bath and I gave up. I gave up at Bath. I had enough. So I walked away from Bath, went unemployed, got a Wrexham job. And then I earned. Literally, I went from League One, League Two football player, Bath job, earned no money, skin. Got a Wrexham job, earned a few more quid. And then Arsenal went, have the job, is over 100 grand a week. I had to take it, had to. And we done well at Arsenal, Europa League, runners up. In the, how, how didn't we win that first season in the Premier League? We bottled it at the last minute. But we won the Europa League, we won Cups, we won the Champions League. Once we won the Champions League, which is that one, I think. No, it's that one, isn't it? Um, I walked out of Arsenal and I went to my real, real Madrid. Invincibles! Oh, where's that button? I'm going to have to pull it. Uh, and then we went Invincibles. We'd done the impossible. We went Invincible at Madrid. Two titles out of three. Two European Cups out of three. I won the European Cup, what, four, three out of four years with different clubs? Uh, I'll get to you one second. <laughs> uh, yeah, so at Real Madrid, I took on the Welsh bosses' job. I got them to the Euros. 
After that, it fell apart. I left Madrid, went to Cardiff. I want to produce Welsh won the kids. So that's why I ended up at Cardiff. And we're now in at the start of our second full season. Uh, asking it, I'm not an expert. I'm not an expert, but thank you. Thank you so much for that, Warlord. Um, Ivan Tony, I feel, could go any club, can he? he? He's a, I think he's a top, 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 top player. And if he ends up, I, I know Game Messiah is like gutted if he goes to Chelsea. I thought he'd end up at Arsenal this summer. Game Messiah is an Arsenal fan. Um, but yeah, yeah, I'm, I, I'm a bit shocked at Ivan Tony hasn't moved if he moves. Um, just catching up there. Game Messiah will lose his mind as if he goes to Chelsea. He will score more goals than Zachary for sure. Josh is going to go mental on that. <laughs> <laughs> oh brilliant oh as always brilliant 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 the chat room yeah you got good yeah yeah fair one fair one i'm gonna say warlord i'm gonna call you a warlord if that's okay um <laughs> i'm all for it names But Josh is a big Man United fan. Oh, that's the first time that's happened. We've got a player what could be in the um, top goal scorers. Pete is fine too. No worries, Pete. I'm Gareth, the tough man. Ten. That's cool, buddy. That's cool. Dirty Jim's not back. He's close, so I don't think I can really change it. Uh, Jordan, unbelievable signing. Emil, the Dutchman, John, Ricardo, Oli, Julian. He'll be right. Jack, Murray, Rob. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Sweet, 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 sweet. <laughs> nice, Reese. Nice. Who do you support, Reese? Uh, please say Cardiff and Liverpool. Please say Cardiff and Liverpool. If you say Swansea and Man U, oh, I'm only joking. I'm only joking. Right, we've got another game right here, right now. Cardiff, Bluebirds, Bluebirds. <laughs> right, just for you, Reese. Just for you. Bluebirds! Bluebirds! <laughs> My gosh. We're at four hours, 22 minutes. So, bear with me. I will be back in just a second. The last break of the night. Um, yeah. Quick break. I was just checking a couple of things. Quick break. I will be back in about... Four minutes, four minutes max. So go and get the kettle on. Bless me, get the coffee on. Go and do what you got to do. I will be back. Thanks ever so much, all of you. I want to know more about that, uh, Pete. Uh, <laughs> Cardiff inspired Twitter. And I thought that was just me. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. I want to hear more about that. But I must run to a loop. So, I will be back in a couple of modes. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate all of you. Thanks, thanks, thanks so much. Bluebirds! Bluebirds!
You pigs, you pigs, you lovely, lovely pigs, the top man loves you pigs. Welcome back <coughs> to the Tough Mountain Show. That didn't work quite well, did it? <laughs> Welcome back to the Tough Mountain Show. That's better. Cheers, cheers, cheers. <laughs> oh, Josh. The old badge. I love the old badge. Uh, the original badge. But the new one. I do like the new one more. And that's the one. Look, what we've done is made it like a club. So the new badge is like a club. <laughs> but the old badge, the original badge, was great. Um, but yeah. Here we go then. We're, we're going to crack this friendly off.
And yeah, never forget, we are on YouTube. Uh, don't forget, we are on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, Discord. You can't join Discord. I've got to change that. Game Messiah told me that. <laughs> I'm going to try and work that out tomorrow. That's tomorrow's problems. Um, oh, no, it is tomorrow. That's later's problems. <laughs> Too much. Oh, I've been taffed off by Josh. Too much like Liverpool. Oh, mate. I uh, oh, I love the original badge, but the new one's much better. <laughs> All down to me and Smokey Hayes 8. Right. As always, in pre-season, we do the same thing. The experiment continues. Fabrico, Jack and Peter on the wings. I was so close to changing the formation. I really was. Sit down, sit down. I nearly changed my tactics. No, I live and die by these tactics. <laughs> oh, there's Game of Sire on top of the screen. <laughs> I was going to sell, Julian. Great goal. But the fact that he took a 20 grand wage cut just shows how committed he is to Cardiff. And you've got to remember, I was the Real, Mad Real Madrid boss. Pep Linders was my assistant. And we're both at Cardiff. How can this be a recipe for disaster? It's not. We're going up. We're going up. We're going we are the Premier League. It's coming. It's coming. I feel it. I feel it in my fingers. Do you know what I mean? We are literally going to go up this year. I'm going to look really silly. <laughs> if we don't. But I believe I've done the best business ever. I've ever done. Not quite ever done. But without a but You know, on a free transfer world. Nicely done, Robbo. Offside, I thought it was. <laughs> Vindano. <laughs> it took me a while to read that there. You were about to say, say it, Game Messiah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's get through March first. Just spot on. You're spot on, Game Messiah. You're absolutely spot on. Vindaloo! <laughs> oh, Vindaloo, Vindaloo. I can't remember the rest of the song, but it was a song once, wasn't it? <laughs> With Lily Allen's dad, wasn't it? Uh, is it Pete Allen? I, all I've got is Vindaloo, Vindaloo. I got, I've got nothing more. I've got nothing more. <laughs> and the best thing is, I can still sign players. Van Voort and Sunder Sutherland look like they should have played forever together. The one position I would argue I would have liked to have bought is a left back. But Williams is doing a job. And we can still sign more. No lone players so far. I'm not having Savvy phoning me up every week. 
And we got Jordan Griffiths in goal. That is the best business we've done. I knew last season we had a shit goalie. Uh, it's past nine o'clock, I can swear. Do you United and ruin it all? I said ruin rather than that word. <laughs> <laughs> yes mate like the old regime at United that's how I do foot manager I think like Fergie I know as a Liverpool fan that's wrong employ people to do your job <laughs> and I just do the bit at the end <laughs> I'll pick the team I'll tell them how to play and I'll encourage them or have a go at them <laughs> but even as a Liverpool fan, you cannot what you can't knock what Fergie done at United. You just can he not do that? Same as Arsenal winger at Arsenal, you can't knock what they done. And I'm gonna say um, Sven Goran Eriksson. You know, rest in peace, Sven. Um, yeah, definitely Ab Aberdeen first as well, mate. Yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Um, I'm only bringing Sven into it because he died a few days ago. Rest in peace. He was a nice bloke. I met him on a few occasions. I'm lying. I'm lying. <laughs> Nah, but fair play to him. Yeah, what he done at Aberdeen is a bloke what ran a pub and then he took Aberdeen on, ex footballer, of course, ran a pub, took Aberdeen. Was it? Well, it would be the Europa League nowadays, wouldn't it? But yeah, to win a competition, a European competition, or Aberdeen, never been done before, never been done since. Unbelievable achievement, and it doesn't matter who you support, it doesn't matter who you believe in, in football. Fergie done an amazing job, amazing manager. He's Sir Alex for a reason, isn't he? Kenny Dalglish was obviously better. <laughs> was it UEFA Cup he won? I'm sure Game Messiah will tell us. No, mate, no. I give respect to Fergie. Hat off, hat off. As a football fan, you've got to give him respect for what he done. Yeah, oh, mate, you, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm nice about the mank wanks every now and again, Josh. <laughs> but you've got to give credit to what Fergie done at Aberdeen. Was it UEFA Cup? I'm trying to think. It might have been the Cup Winners' Cup. I'm not sure. Um, as I said, I'm sure Game Messiah or Josh will correct me. Um, but, yeah, you've got to give Fergie credit. Man United were awful when he took over. And he turned, him, turned them into serial winners. You know, I've just got my first job in real life. I've done four years at Sunday League. Won a cup, won a promotion as a manager in real life. Um, I've just done my first bits with the English FA. Um, and I'm going to take over an under seven teams next year. And I can't wait. I can't wait to uh, do Wiltshire FA are going to pay for my coaching badges as well. Can't wait.
Scottish cunt. Scottish Cup, they chant for the UEFA Cup, Winners Cup, and the UEFA Super Cup. And that is unbelievable at Aberdeen. Unbelievable at Aberdeen. Anyone who says differently, it's just, yeah, you're not a real football fan. I might be a Liverpool fan, but you've got to give credit where credit deserves. You don't become Sir Alex for no reason, do you? I thought he was about to sign for us. Oh, nasty Jim. All right. Does he deserve it? No. No. All right, cancel that then. <laughs> oh, you're spot on, Game Messiah. Absolutely spot on. That Lazi Lazio team was unbelievable. Uh, Nesta, Veron, Mancini, Nedved. Bostek, Salas, Falco, the original. <laughs> I like them. I like the fact you put the original in there. Uh, Alm I, I'm going to get that wrong name. Armande, Simone, what a side. Yeah, Veron didn't work at United. I remember reading reports about um, Veron. He was walking around Manchester like a crazed man at night. His missus hated it, didn't he? His missus hated being in England. Well, I don't know why. I've spent a lot of time in Manchester, and it's a lovely city. Um, but, yeah, it didn't work. And he is a quality player. Is, still, is he still is? Is he still going? We should keep an eye on this lad. We should keep an eye on this lad. All right, we're getting close to our new season. We've had a good pre-season. All right, hands up. Coaching also. Oh, I'm thinking of the other one. Oh, I'm thinking of the other one. PSG player. X-Man United. I don't want to say big ears because that's rude. Ah, oh, what's his name? Veron was the bald one. I'm getting them confused. No. No, can't think of his name. But yeah, to beat Salford, Forest Green, older shot. Demera, that's the one, Josh, spot on. Ten points to Josh. <laughs> Spot on. I meant the mirror. Yeah, spot on, mate. Spot on. You got it right. Uh, Bradford away on Tuesday, Hibs, and then we start the season. He, retwi he retired twice. Bit like me, really. <laughs> I retired a few years ago and then I had to go back to work. <laughs> oh, I just love the fact that we've still got money to burn. Mm hmm. Jordan is going to be the best player. Yeah. What is the opportunity of getting that lad on? No. There's no point. Right. We've played a Bradford game.
So, Jordan in goal. Emil Van Voort, John Ricardo. Ole, Julian. Yeah, the new boy, Fabrico. Jack Murray Robbo. Then we got, don't worry about that bit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. All right. Jim can go on the bench. I don't think Jim's got a spot in the team anymore. The dirty Jim. Oh, I can't remember. Um, cool. No. I was going to change the tactics then to go to how I'm going to play in, in the championship. But no. Let's see how we do with my tactics away at Bradford. So, a League One team. A League One team. And we're going for it. As always, we do the same thing over again. Have done since Bath. Oh, I love their ground. And sad as hell what happened at Bradford once upon a time. Much respect to that club. Right, I've got 9% of the tablet left. I'm going to have to get my back up. <laughs> Good learning lesson. Good learning lesson. I would have went a counter-attacking football here. I wanted to see how the boys do without doing that. But tonight has not. It's done. Oh, I'm unbelievable, Jeff. I can ask for more for tonight. We come on. I thought I'd probably leave Cardiff, if I'm honest. Um, but what we sold, what we brought in, we've got a chance. I'm excited for next season. And you're absolutely spot on, Game Messiah. Let's get past January, December. <laughs> Even March. We know our track record. Ole, coming forward. Not anymore. Oh, Jack. That's worth a button. My first sign in at Cardiff was Jack Hughes. And he's only, only produced... Absolutely magical moments for us. We made him be a right winger. Well, we got Fabrico. So he can play through the middle. Oh, I'm going to listen to Pep. Pep Linders, my assistant. Got to listen, don't you? You got to listen. Well, you don't, but. I want them to play 70 minutes. I, I, I earmarked Van Voort, who's got the ball there, a long time ago. I'm chuffed that he's at the club. Oh, Peter Murray! Peter, 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 Peter Murray! The two Irish lads linked together there. Robbo and Murray.
Hussey, Doogie, Londa, all great players. Power. I got a, actually that's something I need to check. How's Philippe not getting in the team? Right, and then the kids. I believe he is Luka Modric in disguise. He won the European Championship as a child. And the best, best bit of business all night was getting Jordan Griffiths. I don't care. You may disagree. That's fine. But getting Jordan in goal was amazing. Um, great signings. Well, I, I may have made 11 signings. And I'm not done yet. Um... Nice one, Jonesy. Why do you even question the offside? Why? I don't know. See, I don't know. It's been a perfect night of football manager. Uh, okay, I know it's pre-season. Doing it with you, Josh. Doing it with you. <laughs> I'm not doing the Kermit. I'm not doing the Kermit. Um, but yeah, it's been a great, perfect night in my eyes. Um... Right, last bit of business before I say ta -la. Ah, oh, Jack, Jack, Jack. He's got two years, so we don't have to worry about it too much. Right, I think that's been a bloody good productive night, if I'm honest. The games are irrelevant. Yeah, we won them all. We'll probably lose to Swindon at home. Um, I'm going to leave it with the last friendly against Hibs on Sunday. And then we start the real stuff with Swindon at home. Uh, I normally run through other stuff, but what a window, what a window. The club financially sound. We've done everything we can. <laughs> Cheers, gay. Oh, I just looked uh, and I'm chuckling. I think we've done everything we can at Cardiff to secure a future and I'm confident. All right, might be blind faith, 
for sure, for sure. It's still ninth. Cheers, buddy. Cheers, buddy. So, yeah, I think we've done really well at Car Cardiff. Um, I'm going to end it with saying we got loads of money. And we got budgets. So, it's not over. It's not over. There's still maybe more signings. Cardiff. Bluebirds. Bluebirds. To the Premier League. Oh, we'll see. We'll see. Pre-season 23. Maybe over. We got Hibs to go, and then we start the campaign against Swindon. Right, there we go. I'm going to end it here. I am going to end it here. Thank you so much, Josh, for the subs, the bits. Jack, for the bits. Game Messiah, as always. Knowledge, you're brilliant. Um, thanks for your knowledge. I love it, love it, your love bits, it. Your bits, your lovely, lovely <laughs> bits. The tough man loves your bits. Cheers, Josh. Cheers, Josh. You stopped me in my tracks, as always. But I love it. Your bits. Your bits. Your lovely, lovely bits. Cheers, Josh. Cheers, Jack. Bless me. And everybody else who's popped in, the newbies, everyone. Really appreciate it. Um, I'm going to have to look at Discord in the morning and try to get that working again. Um, not a problem. Uh, I will do that. Uh, but everyone's welcome to join Discord. You know where I am. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. I'm trying to think of someone else to thank. <laughs> so that's me done. Thank you all. If I forgot you, I apologise. Thank you all for popping in, saying hello. Much love to you all. Oasis are reformed. Mega fan. And I'm not happy. Leave it, Oasis. Leave it. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I'll leave it on that note. Cheers, cheers, cheers. I'll see you next time. Probably tomorrow. Till then. Till then.